Nani? Mukuro Ikusaba, uh -huh. the 16th student, lying hidden somewhere <gasps> Nani, in the school. Nani, already heard this, the dude. One oh. Oh, shit! Three days before the worst thing so far would reveal itself. What the fuck? Whoa! Wait, pain of a junk food junkie? What a whimsical opening to yeah. someone being murdered. Is she trying to say something? I think she's almost just a little more and I might get it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I have no idea what it is you're trying to tell me. You're incapable of performing sign language with those minuscule hands. <laughs> well, I'm gonna need a microscope to look at what you're signing to me. <laughs> I hope it's not anything too creepy. Okay. Yeah. What could be creepy about a situation in which eight of our friends have been killed <laughs> in the last three days? Oh, hello. Whoa. It must be at least vaguely familiar to you. After all, you've been around your fair share of corpses. Are you saying? It's the smell of death. They're flesh and fat and blood. <laughs> wow. Oh, Byakuya. Why don't you have more friends? Yeah. There was no surprise in his voice, no shock, he did it. As far as this room goes, I don't know a thing. I just left it exactly how I found it. What? Yes, indeed. How's that for a hint? Better than those stupid hints you get from NPCs and those mean old RPGs. <laughs> but it's Stop pretty- Stop using Spon acronyms. <laughs> Sponsored by RPGs, you can go get them at RPGs.com or GameRumps.com. <laughs> um, Byakuya, what about what Monokuma just told us? It's like I'm not even here. He must be lost in thought. <laughs> it's just like a little thought bubble comes up, and it's it's like a, like a bear getting hit on the head with a mallet. Like, yeah. boink, <laughs> boink. If you shit in a bowl of Rice Krispies, do they go snap, crackle, poop? <laughs> <laughs> did you just did you just come up with that? Yeah, man. <laughs> Hashtag just Byakuya things. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything else in here? It's just the camera and the TV screen. Wow. <laughs> I mean, it seems like a pretty examinable room, and yet... Yeah, seems like there might be evidence hidden somewhere within. <laughs> uh, oh, he's the same line. All right, well, I guess I'll just leave then. Fuck it. Like, yeah. I guess this room isn't very important. What Kyoko told me yesterday, what the heck did it mean? If you poop into a bowl of rice krispies. <laughs> <laughs> Mukuro Ikabusa. Ikusaba. Sorry. Lying hidden somewhere in the school. Oh. The one they call the ultimate despair. I mean, she's not really whispering. She's just talking normally close to his ear. Maybe that's why he's... The one that called it. <laughs> Whoa, back off! Her gaze darted up to the surveillance camera, as if to tell me something. But what?! Hey. What is it about the camera?! <laughs> you understand why, right? The camera?! <laughs> she was trying to tell me that whatever it was, it was important. The mastermind couldn't find out, so maybe we should go to the- Makoto is like saying this out loud. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, I want to know what Kyoko has to tell me about this secret person, Ikusaba! Oh, I wonder if I can get HBO. Ooh, uh, what is this? This thing is super- And more importantly, can I sit on it? <laughs> Yasuhiro, what do you know about these plants, and can I sit on them? It's a chicken. It's chicken. That's the sound a rooster makes. <laughs> That's true. It's really alive, right? There's In fact, these all look like roosters. No, they're all chickens. Right, but the 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 head adornments look like roosters, don't, wouldn't you say? No. 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 Okay. They look like chickens. I then. Okay. I can look it up if you want. Forgive me. N no. No. I... I do not care. <laughs> Grew up on a barn, dude. I fucking know what chickens look like. They fucking... Okay. They fucking buck buck baga, dude. Do you want to fight? I've, I, I moved on from this like two minutes <laughs> okay. ago. Oh, you like chickens too, Makoto? <laughs> yeah, I love these little guys. They're seriously cute, right? There's exactly five of them here. <laughs> Can we talk about something else? <laughs> exactly. 
five. You know, the number that comes after four and before six. Wow, that was actually almost word for word the line I was going to say to make fun of him. <laughs> I need to head back to the dining hall and find out what the others turned up. Turn up. Yo. Or what they turned down. <laughs> and for what? It's your boy, soldier boy in Dubai in front of a camel turn up. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of my favorite You're videos right of all time. Have you ever have you ever seen that video? Which it's, one? It was when Vine was still a thing. It's Soldier Boy, and he's he's it's a, it's a Soldier Boy, and he's like, "It's your boy Soldier Boy here in Dubai in front of a camel turn up." <laughs> and then it's him walking, and it's like a shot of his shoes, and he's like, "Get the, the new, new shoes, shoes God damn!" <laughs> and then that's the whole video. Well, you know what? Can I, I? I just decided to look up the turndown for what mm -hmm. lyrics. Can I read these to you? Yeah, real fast? sure. I'd love that. I'm just gonna blast through it real quick. Yeah, man. Fire up that loud! Another round of shots. Turn down for what? 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 Fire up that loud! Another round of shots. Turn down for what? 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 Fire up that loud, another round of shots. 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 Turn down for what? 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 That's the end of it. That song has four credited songwriters. <laughs> Hello and welcome back. Aaron has just watched the Turn Down For What boat video that was sweeping the nation nine years ago. <laughs> Uh, that's fun. I've right? never seen it before. It's hysterical. <laughs> that's amazing. It's, it's 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 really what it is. Is the guy? <laughs> it's the it's the guy who's driving yeah, the, the boat. The, the boat driver. <laughs> like his his face plant is astonishing. <laughs> the, it's just it's for anybody who's an animator. It's like it's like he tweens down. Like it's like a really bad tween. Like it doesn't feel like a natural movement. It it feels like totally fake. He just woof, like immediately goes down. It's fucking wow. But still, it's just the six of us. That's barely enough for a decent volleyball team. Hey, don't be a sourpuss. We gotta think positive. Also, I would cream anybody's volleyball for really doing that. Besides, don't be a sourpuss. <laughs> yeah. Your best friend here died like 13 yeah. hours ago. Don't be such a negative Nancy in the murder school. My concern is with the bib lab. Bio lab. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My concern is with the bib lab. That was the only place on the fifth floor that we couldn't access. I'm a messy eater, so it's troubling that I wasn't able to get in. <laughs> the bib lab, huh? I mean, bio lab. Fuck. <laughs> Listen, more important, now that we have the knife, what are we going to do with it? Stab Yakuya? We're going to stab Yakuya, right? Yeah. Hmm. Well, you did put that brick in my face, so what am I going to do <laughs> with it? Did Master just praise me? Make a few. <laughs> I'm dreaming. I must be dreaming. Uh, that would never. I would never. That I would never. That I would. Uh, let me start over. Uh, Aaron, take a breath. That I would ever experience such a dream. Uh, uh, I feel so strange. Ah, uh, so strange. Really, really strange. Oh no. <laughs> can we put this on the internet? <laughs> what I noticed was the lawnmower. I'm thinking maybe we can use it to call for help. Oh yeah? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Go on. <laughs> How are you gonna call for help with a lawnmower? Alright. Okay, I'll bite. I don't know. <laughs> maybe I can use it to make crop circles or something. Yeah, that's it. I'm gonna make crop circles. Well we could use those to call for help. What the heck happened to you? <laughs> you were once so smart. Now, things have gone awry. You weren't like this in the beginning, you know. You know? Well, back then my personality hadn't quite solidified <laughs> yet. The writers didn't give me a lot to do, yeah. frankly. We need to avoid raising any more unnecessary suspicion. So, Kyoko, it's time you told us. <laughs> I can't. <gasps> Why won't you tell us? Wrong. I didn't say I won't. I said I can't. What the heck? <laughs> I'm in the ultimate bind. 
What do you mean? <laughs> because I don't remember. Okay. <laughs> I have no memory of what I I'm have. the ultimate amnesiac. <laughs> yeah, that's... I did not see that coming. Give me the key to your room. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's not how you do it, man. <laughs> yeah. Just give me one night out. Italian, maybe. What are your interests? Where do you like to go on a first <laughs> date? Fine. I understand. Hmm. Good. You're finally in the mood for conversation. <laughs> Makoto's like, don't worry, you can stay in my room, Kyoko. And she's like, okay, cool. And Byakuya's like, damn it! Fuck! <laughs> that fires every time. Kyoko! I've been waiting for you in the dressing room. I'll be waiting for you in the dressing room. <laughs> Sorry, I have trouble with tenses. See you there. Hey, hey, wait, Kyoko! Without acknowledging me, Kyoko disappeared into the depths of the darkened hallway. I know we're not supposed to go out during nighttime, but I can't just not go. Oh, boy. Dope. <laughs> Get undressed. <gasps> and hello! We are back, baby. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> <laughs> where, where am I? <laughs> it's like me like pulling the dirt off my <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is this is when people find out that um in between Game Grumps episodes, you and I are just buried deep within the earth <laughs> so we can recharge our battery cells and then be ready to do another episode. Just absorb the nutrients of the earth. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, it was cold down there. It was Sakura. She did it for us. She did? Indeed. Remember what she said in her note? I'm not going to just lay down and die. I will fight you. So Sakura broke into the headmaster's room for us? That's right. That's right. So that we could uncover whatever secrets may, might lay hidden within. She did that for us. Sakura. Do you have <laughs> fucking biscuits in your ears, dude? Like, yes. I just, I just imagine he's like, he's like Blair witching it in the corner, just like staring at the wall. She, Sakura, she did this for us. She did it. She fights. Sakura. <laughs> it's like, dude, are you okay, man? Does that mean Mukuro Ikusaba really could be the mastermind? Anyway, we're on a highway to the danger zone. So pack your bags, bitch. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> this key is the one big opportunity we've been waiting for to get our hands on. She's like trying an opportunity to like get a laugh. She's like thinking about how serious she is all day. She's like, maybe I should say something funny. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to work in a joke at precisely 4.16 p.m. <laughs> bitch. Uh, anyway, this key is the one. <laughs> no. Now that we've grasped it, we can't let it go, can Sure, we? but I mean, what's this key even unlock? So... It's the key to my heart! Hmm? Have you ever thought of how funny <laughs> the word exploit is? <laughs> exploit. <laughs> oh, baby, I'm gonna exploit! <laughs> it sounds like when, like, like slime, like, pools up and then drips down and just exploit! Oh, he exploited. <laughs> In other words, we gain something whether we succeed or not. Now there's no reason not to do it, right? Uh, we still other could than die. One of our deaths. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But if you spend all your time trying to avoid danger, you'll never move forward. Oh. Apparently, a very important one. Wow, she line. basically just said, "Fucking grow a pair." <laughs> we know the danger, but if that risk means solving the mystery, we have no choice. You hey. fucking nutless wonder. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> she came down! She wore a crown and came down in a bubble, dog! Was <laughs> 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 that, oh, that from Wizard of Oz? <laughs> yeah, you've never seen that video? No. The guy's having an argument after a game of headbands. <laughs> He's like, HOLD UP! HOLD UP! HOLD UP! Oh, that's right, that's right. <laughs> yeah. And he's super mad. Her sister was a witch! <laughs> Only open it if something ever happens to me. No! No! Don't anything happen to her, yeah. please. If something happens... That's exactly what, <laughs> that's what Sakura said, and she was dead within the hour. Yeah. 
What are you and Kyoko up to? Going to the bathhouse? Just the two of you? In the middle of the night? Definitely a hot and steamy moment, wouldn't you say? So warm and wet. So wet and warm. Bet you guys. Removed to conform with the local international censorship laws. <laughs> I love her, didn't you? Oh. I'm nervous. Yeah. I'm so I'm, I'm like super attached to every character, except for the ones that I hate, like Yaki and yeah. Toko. Yep. Oh, is that it? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, Sakura. What the fuck? Damn, this is different. Has this ever been a visual style? No. This time, it's virtual. Damn, dude. Damn, 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 damn. Sakura's awesome. Why'd you have to die? Yes. Great question, Aaron. So upsetting. <laughs> hey, everybody! Let's do a dance. Go for it. Go for it, girl. What are you waiting for? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. S Sakura's Revenge, the game the world has been waiting for. Unfortunately, development has been canceled. Of course, if enough people buy Dog and <laughs> <laughs> This game's funny. Yeah. I, I like the weird sense of humor. A super stylish, super fashionable game was canceled during development. But it'll start back up if Danganronpa sells well. Then you guys have to recommend it to your friends. Oh, okay. Nice. Nice. Well, wow. Pretty bold to do that, like, fucking 30 hours into the game. You're looking for Miss Carrie Gary? Any idea where she might have gone? We have no idea. And even if we did know, we wouldn't tell you. What the heck? For serious. Hmm. I see. Time for y'all to die. I don't care anymore. Sign our suckers! <laughs> <laughs> as soon as he was gone, we all glanced around at each other. He's such a jerk. <laughs> yeah. So like he's already killed eight of your friends, and then he's like, Smell you later, dickwads! <laughs> <laughs> like, Come on, man. This is all for hope. And that's why what? I have to stay. What? What in the I world? To stay here. Uh, it's probably just my Stockholm Syndrome. Anyway, I woke up. Yeah, <laughs> yeah geez, I, I, I don't understand that <laughs> comment. My dream just now... What? So strange. Huh? I kind of liked it. Ah! Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! 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 Oh, are we, are we dying right now? Know. What's happening? <laughs> Oh. What in the world? Mm, Nintendo? Kyoko? What the? What did you? What did you say? What the? Gosh dang it! Fuck. So confusing! Uh -oh. Oh, oh. The Fuck her mother. And there was a strange person standing next to my bed wearing a mask. And they were holding a knife. Could you imagine how long it would take to do anything if everyone recapped what they just oh said and saw so true. five seconds previously? I want to say I fought them off, but I don't actually remember. Felt like my mind had been detached from my body, burning up with fever. <laughs> I dropped a load of piss in the toilet. I flushed. <laughs> I remember flushing. It was... it was... <laughs> intense. An intense sound what rang through my head. counterclockwise. <laughs> As I walked away from the toilet, I remembered the piss that I just took. Just like Hina said, everyone was there besides Kyoko. And then I noticed they formed a circle around something. As soon as I saw what that something was. What the? Before I could catch myself, I'd cried out. Whoa. Whoa, damn. Didn't expect that. Spread out in front of them were the remains of Monokuma. The smartest of us was working on his mechanics. <laughs> when I found him, he was no more than a regular toy. He didn't react. Didn't say a word. Like a Furby that hasn't learned Furbish yet? Hmm. <laughs> I... Are you serious? So immediately I initiated the desist... The desist... The desist... <laughs> <laughs> the breakdown process. It was masters. It's a stroke of genius. A chance to. F I just straight up porky pig that line. 
He's my chest. This is this is this is this break. Hey guys, I don't think now's a good time for light conversation. I just found something. What is it? It's bomb like and it looks like a bomb. It's got a timer like a bomb would have, and it explodes like a bomb. It's any ideas? <laughs> oh yeah, the pickaxe. I see. Interesting. That could very well be exactly what we need. Now then, Toko, what time is it? <laughs> it's hammer time! What? <laughs> what? We left the chip. No, it's, it's pickaxe time. <laughs> but but I'm still super stressed. Yeah, yeah, we're all stressed, hero. We're all stressed. Not chill and relaxed like our dead friends. <laughs> I'm so tense I can hardly talk. I'm all flubbist. No. I'm totally flabbag, flapstaff, <laughs> flappy jack. <laughs> Damn it. Frap uh, This is a level of uselessness I find difficult to tolerate. So You could just go get the pickaxe yourself. <laughs> yeah. You lazy dude. It's been ten minutes. Uh nothing has happened. I'm not missing out on life. In fact, I found one in the garden. What? What did you find? Corpus. Did you hear me? I said corpse! A corpse! Oh no! That's right, I found a corpse in the garden. No, not Kyoko, please, God, no. <laughs> God, no, 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 no. As soon as we entered the garden, I saw it. I didn't want to, but. Oh, okay. Oh. No, that's what we, that's what was in the flash forward that we saw. Oh, right. I saw someone laying on the ground with a mask covering their face, and there was a knife buried in their stomach up to the hill. W -w what the? Are they really dead? For sure, but who is it? All right, we get our Scooby Doo moment. What? Oh no! Oh, it's like the second part of Chapter Five, I guess. Oh, okay, sure. Be alive, Kyoko. <laughs> Just to make things clear, to the dead, dead. There's a dead man. Last night I was attacked by someone wearing a mask, and whoever that was, now they're a dead man. Where? Do they think whoever plays this game gets hit on the head every 30 minutes and forgets everything they've seen? Yeah, the jacket's on backwards now, though. Ah, or yeah. not on at all. It looks like it's just placed over the body. Or or it's just a robe. We need to find out who this actually is, but there's no way to tell with the mask covering their face like that. We'll never know! Oh, God. Who go yeah. Let's just tear the mask clean off! Come on. Wait, don't. <laughs> That would be too easy. That wouldn't be hilarious. <laughs> By the time he called oh, out, right. it was already too late. Toko's hand shot toward the mask. Thank God. And in the next instant... Yeah, right. Whoa! Whoa! There was a Whoa! <laughs> there was a blinding light, a deafening roar. The body blew up. It 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 blew up. Oh, man. I guess Toko's dead now. My vision Maybe. started to darken. I prepared to pass out, but then... Hurry up. Put out the fire. As my I'm already bored. <laughs> <laughs> Did Toko get blown up into the man-eating plant? Oh my god. Hilarious. Because she was headed, like, right up there in that picture. That's so funny. Oh, so... Totally... undiscernible now? Dang it! <laughs> the other day, Kyoko confided in me. So I probably shouldn't be saying this. She said there was a 16th student here in the school. I think you'd better tell us everything you know. Well, uh, all Kyoko told me was... If you poop in a bowl of fresh But <laughs> If she's been hiding here in the school like some teenage Bigfoot... How'd she wind up burnt to a crisp? Well, she exploded. Oh... None of this makes any sense! To just suddenly show up and then die? That's fucking rude! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Leave a note or something! Are we forgetting something, you know, Togo? Oh yeah, she got totally blown up, huh? Forget about her. I'm sure the explosion vaporized her. Wow, Byakya. <laughs> spoken like a great- Oh, uh, no! She's alive! <laughs> when I went to insert the key I'd found in the garden into the keyhole that is not visible, the key w isn't even close to fitting, which means the key doesn't go to this room. Dang it. Alright. Fuck! Then this is the key to the data center. I'd managed to unlock the data center. I guess all that running around paid off. I have to go tell everyone else. 
I immediately headed back to the garden and didn't go into the data center that I just unlocked. Yeah, jeez. So, you're back. What was the data center like? Tell me everything. Yeah. Uh -oh. How'd it go? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was Ooh. Ooh, look at this. In a word, the room was strange. Sexy? Oh, uh, strange. <laughs> hey, that's Aaron? Yeah. Hey, that's Oh, I didn't hear you say that. Hero extended <laughs> okay. a trembling hand and pointed. Look at all those monitors on the wall. They were hissing and Flicking out their tongues like the lizards they are. Look what they're showing! <laughs> Alright, whatever. <laughs> Each monitor displayed a different section of the school. The dorms, the classrooms... Oh, monitor lizard, I get it, yeah. I get it. Okay. Each part of the school is covered. All the cameras in the school feed back into this room. And they're displayed here on these monitors. So that's it. So the sole purpose of this room is to watch us. You're a fucking genius, Byakuya! And the mastermind is dead? Like, really, really dead? <laughs> it would seem so. For serious? It would seem so. <laughs> it's too bad they had to go- It would seem so. <laughs> <laughs> too bad they had to go and die before Master could kill himself. The mastermind is dead? Could that really be true? It would true? seem so. <laughs> Shut up! No matter when, no matter where, surveillance cameras are... Uh... Never... Just... Whatever. I mean, they're Aaron? absolutely everywhere. <laughs> Freaking idiot mastermind. All you guys need to cut free from your regrets of the outside world. And they were sitting here watching TV the whole time. They really thought they could get away with it. Oh, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Hero went through each channel one by one. But on every channel, it was just us. It was a live feed of us standing there in the data center. What the heck? What the heck? Is it broken or something? No, there must be some kind of trick to it. Some weird setup. A trick? What kind of trick? Oh, Actually. God. I'm not sure, but oh, zoinks! <laughs> well then, I'm gonna let you in on a blood gushing secret and tell you about it. That TV is absolutely, without a doubt, displaying the signal coming in on the antenna. But but what does that mean? It's displaying the, the signal. It's just us standing here. Ugh, oh, you're so stupid. Don't you get it? Fine, I'll just tell you. This killing game is being broadcast live to the entire world. It's the most popular thing on TV. Whoa, <laughs> really? What? This killing game is being broadcast live to the entire world. It's the most popular thing on TV. That's crazy, if that's real. What it means is that at this point, we have to figure out who the culprit is. No. Figure out who killed Kyoko? No! What, the heck? what are you talking about? I thought Makuru Ikusaba was the one who died. The victim was female, right? Kyoko certainly fulfills that condition. And if Monokuma is still alive and active, that means that the mastermind, Makuro Ikusaba, isn't dead. So naturally, that body can't belong to her. So it must be Kyoko. Oh my god. No! Way to fucking no! jump to conclusions, dude. Like, you don't know any yeah, of that. Yeah, I'm still, I'm still not sure. There is no other possibility. Oh. Well, Byakuya's sure. I need to go back to the scene of the crime. Back to the garden. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey guys, I have to go- Hey guys, I have to go back to the- <laughs> Either way, this knife... It looks really familiar, but I can't yeah, place so when it. You were, you, you were supposed to be taking care of it yeah. to protect everyone. That's it! It's the knife that person was holding! But where did they get it? <laughs> oh my god. This is getting oh no. really weird. Or maybe it it's the least weird thing that's happened so far. <laughs> There's so, too many strange coincidences. What? That there was a knife and someone took it and then stabbed someone with it? How is that yeah, a coincidence and not just a series of events? And if this really is Kyoko, it would mean Kyoko is the one that attacked me. Why the mask? Yeah, and why was she standing alive after the person in the mask attacked you? Yeah. Is he gonna like shout and say, like, it was me, I did it! And everyone's like, what? <laughs> I just don't know. I, fu 
and and then you run away and simultaneously yell like he's making a break for it and then you tackle yourself <laughs> you start beating himself up fight club style oh these are fake nails they're they're really long they seem like they'd get in the way of normal activity nice. fake nails huh it's also something on the back of her right hand i felt like that was less significant than the fingernails yeah seriously is this a tattoo it got burned so i can't make out the whole thing but Looks like it's a picture of a dog or something. Haha, <laughs> I like dogs. Woof woof. Hey everybody. What were we doing again? <laughs> what? There's only four chickens. Is that why they made a big oh, deal about shit. saying there were five? Definitely. <laughs> I count four chickens, huh? Four? Yo. What's going on, Makoto? Oh dude, Hero's gonna lose be so one of your fucking... fucking chickens? <laughs> he's gonna lose his mind when he finds out there's not five chickens anymore. You know he's just gonna grab the sides of his head and scream like, What?! Yeah. There's only four chickens here now. We're one short. Huh? <laughs> yeah, I knew he'd take it really hard. It's <laughs> <laughs> so weird, I wonder when it disappeared. I was down here just before nighttime last night and there were definitely five chickens then. What? <laughs> what are we gonna do? Going from five to four is gonna have an impact on the structure of the world. Oh my god. Yep, that's our hero. Yeah. If they put the... You you seem to suggest that the robe or whatever that person was wearing was placed on backwards. I don't um, think they, it was even, like, on the body. I think it was just laying over. Yeah, it was just laid over. But it was laid over and then stabbed through. Yes. So that that's weird, too. Makes you kind of wonder if the person died first and then was stabbed afterwards mm -hmm. as a red herring. Oh. Okay, I've checked everything else I could think of. All that's left now is Kyoko's room. I should head back to the garden and ask Byaku Yaku. Byaku Yaku Yakidi Nakanak? Would you accompany me to the garden? <laughs> Get my name right, asshole. Byaku Yaku Nakidi Nakanak. Byaku Yaku Nakidi Nakanak! Who is it? Who's there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But if it is a key, I think I might know what it unlocks. Really? What? The heart! <laughs> Unless I'm mistaken. I'm pretty sure I saw something in the dojo that this might go to. The dojo? Nice. What? what I the... saw something at the dojo that this might go to. <laughs> <laughs> so what is it you're looking for? Nothing in particular, I just thought we might find some kind of clue here. A clue that might help us understand Kyoko. You can't be serious. That's why you made me take time out of my search to come here? Sorry. Regardless, if you plan on poking around at random, you're doomed no matter how much time you take. Surely you have something more concrete. Something to give us more- some sort of direction here. Yeah, the key! Yeah. The key you just stole. More concrete. We wouldn't oh. want to go in- we wouldn't want to go into the bathroom because we might see her bra hanging there, but let's steal her key! Yeah. <laughs> she said if something ever happened, I should open it. Does a corpse exploding count as something happening? <laughs> well, something certainly has happened. <laughs> yeah, so open it. Okay. I opened the envelope and looked inside. Inside was a single piece of paper. Under the sheets. Oh. That's all that was in there? Yeah, it looks like it. Under the sheets, what could it be? I a guess new I'll album look. from Ninja Sex Party. <laughs> yeah. Just I, I don't know what it could possibly mean! I'm gonna leave! <laughs> What's this? Found a crumpled up piece of paper. <gasps> it said, look in the envelope. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! <gasps> I'm caught in a loop! <laughs> Name, Mukuro Ikusaba. Sex, female. Definite asshole. This doesn't feel real. The world I grew up in, it's like a completely different dimension. Then again, I'm just trapped in a murder school. It's like one's yeah. non-fiction and the other's sci-fi. There's no way even to compare the two. That's how different this is. That's what how that was how I saw things as just an ordinary person. But then, <laughs> Biak is just looking at you while all of your thoughts jumble up. That's what. <laughs> that's what was how it was. How. It's about the one writing all the rules. They're actually one of the participants in this killing game. Oh crap! I don't think I ever told you how many participants there actually were, did I? I was thinking I could probably clarify that. When you all first got together in the main hall way back when, there were 15 people there, right? God, look at how alive everyone is. I know. 16! Dude. Then. 
Yukuro Ikusaba. <laughs> Take a for the Rice Krispies. <laughs> <laughs> How many times have we seen that scene? <laughs> it's the best. Obviously, Monokumo is trying to tell us that Mukuro is the one creating the rules to the game. He wasn't trying to tell us, he literally told us. Yeah. But why would he tell us that? And why now? He said he wanted to make things clear so there wouldn't be any complaints later. But the mere fact that he said that proves that Makura is connected to this case. That's why Monokuma revealed the existence of a 16th student. He needs to make our investigation fair. Mukuro is related to the case? Perhaps she's the one who killed Kyoko. What? Or she's the one- I... Yakya, are you stupid? That I'm telling you, he's the dumbest to... character in the entire game. Oh, we're here already. Give it a shot. Uh, Alright, great. Um... I guess I'll check the lock. Wee 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 You pan over and is just tearing it up on like an electric guitar. Yeah. We only have so much time before the trial begins. Let's hurry. Grab my hand. Let us skip. Yeah. We'll cover more ground if we skip together. <laughs> However, some time ago, they completely ceased all activity. I so, is... is Makoto like reading the book? But Byakuya is reading it out loud to him over his shoulder? That's correct. He's probably looking at the pictures. Okay. At present, their continued existence cannot be confirmed. But yes, in order to make sense, their positions should probably be reversed. <laughs> yeah. So did anything jump out at you? This may be your last opportunity to learn about Fenrir. I don't know. And I don't care, to be honest. No, that you mention it. The report said something about where the name Fenrir comes from, right? The Lord of wolf. the Rings, I would guess? Yeah. It says the, it's That's the wolf of Ragnarok. Oh, sorry. That's okay. Speaking of which, <laughs> would you like to know something interesting? You speak French? <laughs> <laughs> I'm running on one and a half hours of sleep. What, really? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't tell uh, me that. Just couldn't, just couldn't get it. Just couldn't get it going last night with that sleep action. Mm. It was, oh, yeah. It was one of those nights where... I just lay there for a while, and I was like, what happens now? <laughs> and then I finally drifted off, and as I was drifting off, I had the thought, like, oh, thank God. And then I opened my eyes, and it was, like, 90 minutes later, and I was like, no! <laughs> <laughs> I, went to, I went to bed last night looking at, um, looking at, like, everyone was talking about Bitcoin, and so I went mm -hmm. to sleep. And I had this really vivid dream that I didn't fall asleep yet, and I was on my phone, and Bitcoin rose to like two million dollars or something, and I was like, oh, I'm rich! <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and, then I, and then I slept through the night and woke up, and I was like, ah! <gasps> What's the Bitcoin at? <laughs> Whoa, Byakya and Makoto showed up together. K-I-S-S-I-N-G yeah. Were you guys making out? <laughs> Where the heck are you two been? You just disappeared in that word! It's difficult to form words when you're making out. <laughs> it's- it's Kyoko. <laughs> oh. If it's me you're waiting for, I'm here. When we heard that voice, we all spun around to look. <laughs> like she comes up all wacky like Monokuma does. <laughs> I'm here, and no rule's been broken. <laughs> Kyoko's theme! <laughs> Kyoko! <laughs> Kyoko, are you still alive? Oh, that's right, we thought she might be dead. I right. forgot about that. <laughs> I made it here just fine. What school regulation did I violate? Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Fuck face. Can you look at me <laughs> and tell me that I'm wrong? You look like a delicious... Bear-shaped black and white cookie from this angle. Oh my god, yes. You go to the grocery store, grab one of those cookies. Oh, right off the deli counter. Hell yeah. yeah. Let's get on with the show! Ooh, ooh. <laughs> and so the curtain opened for the fifth time. Man, really keeping track, huh? A deadly yeah. judgment, a deadly deception, a deadly betrayal, a deadly riddle, a deadly defense, a deadly fate, a deadly... I mean CLASS TRIAL! Can I take a shit real quick? <laughs> no! <laughs> a deadly shit? <laughs> it's Kyoko! There's no other explanation! Oh god, hero. But Kyoko's standing right there. No! That's a ghost! Alright. Oh, oh, hero. <laughs> she has 
his legs and stuff. <laughs> just oh, legs Kina. and arms and Another stuff. Another great contribution <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> from that side of the courtroom. <laughs> then let's compare Kyoko's traits to the traits of the dead body. Number one, it's not Kyoko. Her traits? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like, one important trait she has is that she's alive. Yeah, uh, well, it's her gloves because of her hands, I guess. I was looking for her It's hands. also her piercing glare because she has living eyes that glare. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, this is so <laughs> totally stupid. It's like, all right, I have to prove it's not Kyoko. Kyoko, can you help me with this? <laughs> no, she wasn't. Come on. What the fuck? <laughs> How is that late? It hit the damn text. You saw. Well, Kyoko, any thoughts? These gloves were custom made. Any thoughts on whether I'm alive or not? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I do actually have some thoughts. If I wore fake nails, the gloves wouldn't fit properly. Then that's that. Is that really what we're going? We do we really have to discuss this any further? This like is <laughs> this is so strange. Unless there's a twist where Kyoko is the dead body. This is a, an incredibly weird <laughs> turd for this today. <laughs> it's so stupid. Wait, 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 hold on, no, no, no. Oh, this one. <gasps> Got it. No, you This is a tattoo. This is a tattoo of the bottom of my face. They're like, dude, Makoto, calm down. One clue left behind that we can use to identify the body. If I was um, talking to someone and I brought up. Uh, an opinion or thought I had and they just jumped up and were like, no, you're wrong I'd be like, <laughs> I, I, I think I'm gonna go <laughs> Oh yeah The design's pretty strange, huh? Is this a dog? I don't no, know <laughs> It's a hand <laughs> <laughs> Like all oh, <laughs> condescending <laughs> Well, I guess it could be a, a dog because it's not a ghost because it has legs, but dogs do have legs. Thank you, Hina. Thank you. <laughs> Seems unfair. Like, Mukuro didn't have their own dorm that was, like, with everybody. I don't know. Yeah. Seems, seems a little unfair. Well, they were, they might have been the spy, right? No, that was, uh... I don't know. That was Sakura. I mean, that... Yeah, but maybe there were two spies? I don't know. I'm just saying maybe Mugura had some kind of uh, inside yeah. uh, track to all this. Mm-hmm. All right. The ultimate despair, yeah. You shouldn't have been thinking of her as the ultimate despair in the first place. We don't know how depressed she was. Whip, yeah. whip, whip, whip. Maybe she's like the ultimate despair of nuts. <laughs> Uncovering the identity of the mastermind will have to wait. But remember this. But know this. I have to take a wicked shit. And if we don't get out of here in 30 minutes, this floor is going to be covered in the brown stuff. No matter what happens, we will find out who you really are. I stake my family name on it. I stake my family name on it. Also, I farted and it's a screamer. The whole time we were very careful not to go anywhere alone. We even went to the bathroom in pairs. Um. That's when I took the opportunity to kill Makura. <laughs> we even went to the bathroom in pairs. Wait, Hero, uh, tell them about the yeah. stinky dump I took. <laughs> Actually, strike that last part from the record. <laughs> I have something I'd like to say regarding the whole alibi thing. Um, I think it's stupid, and we shouldn't yeah. think about it anymore. <laughs> I would like one. <laughs> it was after nighttime for sure. I'd say it must have been around 10 o'clock. No, that was around the time that we left to take a big, long, flat stinkum. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I think that one and a half hours of sleep is starting to kick in, man. <laughs> oh my god, my dog just farted and scared the hell out of herself. She just looked at her ass like, what was that? <laughs> hey everybody, okay, welcome back. Let's get oh, snap. Oh, hell, oh, okay. uh, <laughs> Sorry, please. Uh, great okay, opening. Again. Solid. Yeah. Very professional. No, no, <laughs> We've only been doing this for eight years. <laughs> <laughs> no, shut up. Ah. <laughs> Dude, her face is the best. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I remember at 2.30 I was <laughs> brushing my teeth. At the dentist. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you know what? It kind of went... <laughs> Never mind. 
Okay. There you go. Done. They 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 just all look like uh. They just all look like vibrators, like stacked up like that of different lengths. And I was like, Aaron, what kind of man are you? Are you sprinklers, uh, exploded body, or are you a real man who can take fragments near the dead body? <laughs> mm. Mm. Well, uh, let me tell you one thing. Uh, <laughs> I'll give you a look at one of my flat, long, wide stinkums, and then you tell me, you know what I'm saying? Okay. All right, please. <laughs> Maybe we could watch the scene with, like, the, the luchador mask with the knife above Makoto in bed another couple thousand times. Wait, was the hair visible before? Yeah. It was? Mm hmm Wouldn't we have been able to tell that it wasn't Kyoko then, since it wasn't long, it, flowing purple hair? It's- it's kind of pinkish. Fuck. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Only the mouth down south. <laughs> what? <laughs> Even Makoto's like, um. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like, I I was I I was like stunned into silence. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think the voice actress for Toko was like? Do you think the mouth? Da Is this the real line? Can I? <laughs> yeah. Um. This seems like an appropriate time to ask for a raise in my pay. Yeah, I don't remember this being in the audition process. Uh, all right. Yeah. She's gonna be like the house party voice actors where you can't find any information about them anyway. <laughs> the body analysis. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Just remember what the body was like after the explosion, and you'll see what- Oh, is that how she reacted to, Just remember what the body was like after the explosion? Was it her holding her pigtails and screaming with snot no! coming out of her nose? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> so if the sprinklers didn't get the body wet, then the murder must have taken place... At some in the point. garden! <laughs> no, <Yeah>. hero. <laughs> <laughs> I'd just like to say one thing. Is my hair pink or purple or white? <laughs> Can you really tell? I, like, every time I think it's one color, it kind of feels like it's a different color. Yeah. God, you're right. It's like, like that it dress that's green and gold, but also black and blue <laughs> or whatever. I'm not the only one without an alibi. Makoto's explanation is still insufficient. What? Oh, uh, I thought you liked me. Wait a second. Oh, uh, does that mean we're not gonna have coffee later? Sometimes I sort of zone out and I just listen to the music and I imagine like some fucking like raver guy in the background with like Jenko <laughs> jeans, just like fucking with like glow sticks and shit. Just yeah, just doing the mind. swirlies. <laughs> <laughs> now that we have the knife, what are we gonna do with it? Stab each other? <laughs> now that you've got that brick in your face, what you gonna do with it? <laughs> I think that's the exact joke that you made. When this scene happened before. I mean, how could it not? How could it not be? <laughs> we can't let Toko keep it, that's for sure. We don't know what she might do. <laughs> yo, yo. Oh man, I don't know if I want to make uh, the editors do this, because that shit's so buried. But if we get a Don Gon Ronpa style flashback for when you said <laughs> that, <laughs> that'd be incredible. Now that we have the knife, what are we going to do with it? Stab Yakuya? We're going to stab Yakuya, right? Well, you did put that brick in my face, so what am I going to do with it? <laughs> I promise, if it happens again, five episodes from now, my brain will take me down the exact same <laughs> avenue. I bet some unknown quantum particle cause an atomic level spontaneous combustion! Yeah, exactly. Thank you, hero. Am I really proving that it wasn't an atomic spontaneous combustion? Is that what we're proving right now? Yeah, yeah. Just like we had to prove that Kyoko wasn't also the murder victim or the killer. <laughs> like, they literally wrote in a character that was so stupid that- so that they could use all this evidence to prove dumb, obvious shit. I love it. We need to determine what ultimately killed the victim. I need to concentrate. Well, why don't you work in the orange juice factory? Fucking, what didn't kill the victim at this point? <laughs> yeah. She was stabbed, hung, shot, exploded, and she probably had a wasting disease. 
We want to figure out what killed her, right? It just so happens we She's talking about scooping up brains and shit, but I thought she passes out when she sees blood. Yeah. We already know? I knew we could count on you, master. So what was Stop it? drooling. <laughs> Go ahead and tell them, Makoto. Surely you've deduced the right <laughs> <laughs> fucking Byakya. He never knows shit. Yeah. <laughs> He's always like, I figured it out completely. Why don't you tell them? <laughs> Since you're so smart. And folds his hands and huffs. There's one more thing I need to ask her. Will you marry me? Will you me? go out with me? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what'd you say? Will you marry me? Yeah, I said, will you go out with me? <laughs> I mean, of course. Kyoko. I want you to tell me something. When you look in my eyes, <laughs> last night, what do you feel? You were in my room, weren't you? Why? What were you doing there? I was watching you sleep. That's what <laughs> you smell different when you're awake. <laughs> I'm not the killer. And I have no proof. I knew you were stubborn, but this is just getting ridiculous. Really? I think it's Biakia. But you should know better than anyone I didn't Could be. do it. Can you uh -oh. tell me I'm wrong? I should know. Oh man, what? is he finally gonna get it? I don't know. I don't understand. Not, You're ahead of me on well, this one. Well, it's not proof. The lock was in. Oh, I she couldn't have done it. She she sort of said it in the. Sort of gave it away. Why not? Because she had given her room key to Biakmi. Oh dip. That's right. And if I had the key to your room. Then obviously I had no way of getting in without my room. But you did to plant the evidence, you douchebag. Am I wrong? <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> there was a clear contradic. There was a clear contradiction of what Kyoko just told us—an obvious lie. But this. Oh man, don't say it's obvious. This just isn't like her. To try and save That's herself. That's just gonna make me feel stupid. We what? But that wasn't a lie. Was it a lie? Well, I don't know. If you. Oh, if you spend all your time trying to avoid danger, you'll never move forward. We know the danger, but if that risk means solving the mystery, we have no choice. Oh. Am I wrong? <laughs> she came down in a bubble, dog. What do I do? <laughs> I have to decide right here and now whether or not to expose Kyoko's lie. Oh my god. Um. I think she wants you to pursue it. I don't know, though. I honestly have no idea. Okay. Mm, I'm gonna let it go. Really? Yeah. Alright. I've made my decision. I have to believe in Kyoko. There's no way she would kill someone. There has to be some secret here. Something that has to do with the mastermind's trap that Kyoko mentioned. Oh, so supporting her means letting go. Got it. Sorry, yeah. I thought supporting her meant... Um... You know, she was intentionally lying to get exposed so she could move on to something else. Shit, man, this game is messing with my head. Yeah, I mean, Biakia had a room key, right? Yes. You! What are you trying to imply? But of course, nothing that wasn't said five times already. Yeah. I'm on, I was with you guys the entire time. I couldn't possibly have killed anyone or put the key in Kyoko's room. Except when I went off to make that big, wide, flat stinkum. <laughs> There's only For the one love other of God. possibility I can think of. Someone could have had the key on them, then once they arrived at the scene, pretended to find it there. Makoto. It, it had to be Makoto, oh damn! Right? But you were there with me. There's something off about this entire trial. You all see it, don't you? Um, the walls are pink. <laughs> Mukuro, who we didn't even know existed suddenly shows up dead, and then we're thrown into a trial. And Kyoko even said, it's a trap the mastermind set for us. So that's why this has to be okay. Time's up. Oh, crap. Oh, really? Geez. Voting time. <laughs> Spinning the Open camera. Open up the doors and decide which of your friends will now die. <laughs> okay, well. Oh, okay. I guess I'm getting graded. Yeah, straight A's, baby. Well, you did great. Well done. Straight A student. Aside from the fact that we don't know who the killer is, you really aced this trial. Thanks, bro. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? 
Oh, crap. We don't have a- we didn't vote. Yeah, what the- what's happening? Oh, oh what the f- what? <laughs> but, what just happened? But wouldn't it say not guilty because we didn't do it? Did we lose? You got it all wrong, I didn't do it! Good job, everyone! Good job? Yeah, they got it right. No, I know that's not true. None of this makes any sense. This whole trial doesn't make any sense. It makes perfect sense! <laughs> it's the same as always. It's just like all the other class trials. They're not going to end it the same way. It's time for your heart-pounding, positively thrilling punishment! Wait, what? Why do I... Kyoko! I don't expect you to forgive me. I know this is all my fault. What the f- what? Kyoko? Let's give it everything we've got! It's punishment time! What is happening? Why? Oh. I don't understand. I guess we're gonna die. Oh, man! Pretty fun. This sucks, dude! <laughs> Hell yeah. Let's die. Oh my god, is this where we find out Makoto isn't even the main character? Oh man. Are we gonna start playing as Kyoko now? Yeah, what's the punishment for being the ultimate whatever? Yeah. Us? We're the ultimate lucky student. Although, can't say I'm feeling that crazy lucky at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> this is cute. Am I gonna die or what? And fuck this bear! <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're gonna get crushed. That's cool. This sucks. Kind of fun. Wow. What? What? What does that mean? What's happening? Okay, I'm not crushed. Oh, you went through it? You like went underneath it? Oh, I guess so. It, oh, I wish I could read. Oh. Ugh! I hate Monokuma. He's such a tool. <laughs> Smashy, smashy. Damn, he's turning all the colors of the rainbow. Yeah, yeah. Oh, crap. And, whoa. Oh! What? Alter Ego? What the fuck? Whoa! Oh, shit! Alter Ego just saved us! Wait, maybe? Huh. Whee! <laughs> Oh, this is awesome! Wee! Okay, this is not better! <laughs> Unless I land in foam! I'm gonna fucking kill you, dad! Do 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 He's going to kill your dad. <laughs> kill your dad. I could finally feel my mind and body start to come back together again. And then... Transcendence. I was awake. <laughs> or was this just another dream? A dream inside a hopeless nightmare. A dream of a that's dream the, is a dream. <laughs> yeah, that's the worst kind of dream. <laughs> no, this isn't a dream. I could tell because the stench invading my nostrils was too powerful for a dream. What an <laughs> Follow your dreams, kids. Right into the larger, encompassing, <laughs> horrible nightmare. <laughs> I remembered all too well what had happened. <laughs> Chihiro looked pissed. Alter, Alter Ego? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, where could he be? <laughs> Getting out of here isn't going to be that easy. Well, if I'm not getting out of here anytime soon, I might as well crank one. I know, I decided to look around for some food. <laughs> as long as I'm alive, I'll never give up. All right, did, all right, did we come into like an early 2000s emo song? Yeah. Well, what's happening? Yeah. As long as I know how to love, I know how to... Okay. After making that proud declaration, the next thing I decided to do was... Crank one- go to sleep! My sleep was deep and uninterrupted. Except for the cranking. <laughs> Did something fall down over there? Something fell up- fell from up above. Did it fall down here? Maybe- All things fall from up above. <laughs> yeah. What could it have been? <laughs> a cup of noodles. Um, you got a bit of garbage in your hair. <laughs> no, I don't. Are you calling my hair garbage? She gave her head a quick, sharp shake to get rid of the trash, then faced me again. Perfectly clean. 
I snatched the bread and water that she was holding out for me. Within seconds, it was in my mouth and making its way towards my stomach, and then my butt, and then a big flat stink of came- Woo! That really hit the spot! <laughs> you were trying to save me, and I couldn't bring myself to do the same for you. However... But listen, not that I'm trying to make excuses, but... I was, like, really tired, <laughs> and, um, I'll tell you everything. Next time on Get- No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's been, like, two minutes. <laughs> the reason I have to survive... Is so that I can do what I came to this school to do. And, survive. And what is that? <laughs> the thing that I came to this school to do is the thing that's most important. Okay, and what is that? <laughs> my survival. <laughs> <laughs> what? I made up my mind to come to Hope's Peak <laughs> Academy for one very important reason. <laughs> the, e even, the, even the buttons in the corner are like, yeah? <laughs> Do you remember the first thing that happened to each of us as soon as we arrived at this school? Because I don't, on account of the amnesia. <laughs> the, the first thing? If you could actually remind me of the first thing and all the other things <laughs> yeah. up until now, that would be great. That's why I've been investigating this things for- but, oh my. Let me, let me start that over. That's why I've been investigating things by myself this whole time. But if what you say is true, why didn't you ask the rest of us to help you? I don't remember <laughs> if I did that and we all worked as one the mastermind would have noticed right away plus There's always the chance that the mastermind is actually one of us. Oh crap oh, shit There was a limit to what I could do by myself, which is why I asked you to help me but Why me? I just arbitrarily chose you you seem like the least threatening you're an idiot <laughs> Because among everyone you were the least likely to be the mastermind that was just intuition, but... I see. Well, turns out you I mean, were wrong! <laughs> it's basically a miracle you don't put your pants on your head every morning. <laughs> I do! And then I remember. <laughs> your intuition was right, though. Maybe you're not the only one with amnesia. I was finally able to recall my purpose and my ability. Oh my god, so you've known it this whole time and you've just been dicking around? Yes, tell me. You mentioned your ability. Yes, my ability is my purpose, and my purpose is to remember my ability. <laughs> my ability, what everyone should have known me for. I'm the ultimate detective! That's awesome! Oh no shit. We, we, we made a joke about that yeah, earlier. Yeah, yeah. The ultimate detective. You know detective. what? It figures. She's really, she's really sharp. And the reason I came to Hope's Peak Academy, there was someone I had to find here in the school. Alright, who was it? The ultimate average dick. <laughs> you had to find someone who? Well, it was the headmaster of Hope's Peak Academy. The headmaster! Why did you want to find the headmaster? Because he's my father, holy crap! What? In other words... <laughs> I was separated from him as a child. No, no, I said what because out, I didn't actually hear you. What? <laughs> oh. I was separated from him as a child. No, 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 the first part, the part before that. I was. <laughs> 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 it makes perfect sense now, of course, since my whole purpose for coming here was to find him. That does make sense. I'm your father! <laughs> but listen... No, no you're not. The room had been ransacked, the shelves were a mess, the desk drawers dumped on the floor, the rug completely didn't match the curtains. The only conclusion is that someone who didn't know where anything was had been in there. They had no concept of feng shui. <laughs> you mean the mastermind, right? Not much of a mastermind, if they don't know where to place an accent chair. <laughs> I can hear them, you know. The footsteps of the god of death. My grandmother used to call it shining. <laughs> Remember this? I bet you don't. <laughs> I ran into your room and I saw what was happening. Let's start from the beginning of the scene, just so you can see it again. I intervened immediately, of course. <laughs> hey, stop. Quit it, I said. <laughs> So all this would mean that whoever killed Mukuro is also the mastermind, right? I don't have conclusive evidence, but that's what I think. Well, do we ever have conclusive evidence about literally anything? I'm glad you asked. No. <laughs> but that's really bad if true. I mean, it's not worse than, like, being trapped in the murder school, but... <sighs> I mean, goddamn this fucking... Ah! You alright? Yeah, 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 we're good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, don't worry about it. Fucking... Aaron is really struggling with his mic, for those of you at home. Fucking... 
Boom stand. A little more and I should be able to figure out the mastermind's identity. Just one bump. Just, just one more bump. <laughs> <laughs> the identity of the other ultimate despair. <laughs> Not quite as catchy the second time around. <laughs> Make no mistake. They're the root of all the evil that has forced us to go through this. Okay. That is the ultimate despair. And that is our real enemy. So... Oh, I forgot uh, this one was called Pain of a Junk Food Junkie. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, that's right. Okay, so... Everyone survived. Except for the fresh person who didn't show up that second time. Oh, right. Mukuru Mukuro. Oh, I got a little dildo. Dream rocket. Hey, okay. Uh, Ooh, uh, butt plug. It's not a dildo, Aaron. It's a Dream Island rocket. Actually, that is the name of a dildo, so... <laughs> that is one of the more famous brands of dildo. Dream Island Oh, would you like the Dream Island Rocket? Mm -hmm. I would. It's an absolutely vital part of ensnaring the Mastermind. I would never part with it. Okay. And it can open any door in the school, right? Yeah, that's, right. that's right. Then we should be able to use it on that door, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, um, sure. Hey, Kyoko, we can use that key of yours to open this door, right? It's right. True. <laughs> Let's find out. Can we use the key to open the door? Let's see if we can use the key to open the door. But we can- We can use the key to open the door, right? <laughs> the door will open, right? Kyoko took out the key with the Monokuma design on it and slid it into the keyhole. And then... Click. Yes! It opened! Right? <laughs> right. And now we can get out of here. Through the door that we opened with the key. Let's go. <laughs> Sounds good. Right? Oh, jeez. <laughs> The ladder was possibly that hot. long. <laughs> yeah, just look at that hot shot of Makoto. <laughs> yeah, right. I can see his firm apple bottom jeans. <laughs> you got that green bean climbing those ladders there. Mm. <laughs> a detective is neither light nor shadow. They're a detective. <laughs> <laughs> All right, In fact, maybe there's a we lot of things that they are. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't talk while we climb. <laughs> Which is why we've made a conscious effort to conceal our existence. In a hot, <laughs> slathering oil of neutrality. <laughs> yeah. As I wear this, like, these cool, badass boots that really catch your eye, and this jacket that's kind of like a skirt, too, and it really makes the, the, the men go, whoa? A conscious no effort. one notices my flamingo legs that are 8,000 miles long. <laughs> I had absolutely no desire to reconnect with my father. Huh? But you'd be reuniting after all those years, right? You would have had so much to talk about. There's nothing I want to talk to my father about. However, there is something I want to say to him, though. That's talking. I... <laughs> I don't blame him, you know. He had his own life to live. That's what anyone in my position might say, right? But it's not true. Kyoko, could you shut up? However... Kyo Kyoko's literally saying every possible angle for everything. Yeah. I appreciate what he did for me. I can never forgive him. I, I owe him many thanks. <laughs> I hate him. They only saw me as the little girl that was abandoned by her father. That's how they see me even to this day. And I can never forgive him for that. <laughs> I need to thank him. His shadow has been following me my entire life. I'm sick of it. And also, God, I, love I miss it. him. <laughs> yes. I need him out of my life and right back in my life. I need to step out of this shadow and into the light that only he can provide. That's why I have to find him and tell him we're no longer family. And he's the only family I have. In order to settle the past and heal the past and heal the future. In order to remove him from my life forever, so I could see him every day. I have no doubt that he forgot about me years ago. I'm sure he remembers me. <laughs> He's thinking about me all the time. But, <laughs> but your family, to just cut him out like that. Who said anything about cutting him out? Our only connection is through blood, nothing more. And our deep connection through hanging out every day, which we will do. And we are connected- are we connected by heart and soul? No. Only soul and heart. <laughs> is blood really enough to call someone family? Of course it is. 
<laughs> Only connected by blood, not by heart or soul. I was so shocked to hear her say something like that, even though I didn't know anything about her other than what I'm hearing right now. I didn't know how to respond, so instead, I said nothing. I farted a little, hope she didn't get a whiff. <laughs> I just kept climbing the ladder, complete silence. So you're saying rather than just stressing out over getting caught, we should just give up now? Don't worry, what you think is going to happen isn't. Alright. Because... Because I thought a bunch of clowns were gonna start appearing on unicycles. <laughs> are you telling me the clowns are not coming to town? <laughs> Because, no, the because clowns the are definitely mind. coming. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I was talking about. Because no matter how deeply you try to bury it, there is only ever one absolute truth. And now you're trying to talk like some kind of famous detective type? Because that absolute truth is that endless breadsticks are at the Olive Garden. What? Endless. <laughs> Don't you fucking dare try to stop the breadsticks. If Makoto really was the killer, he never would have come to you willingly like this. He would have feared for his life, feared another execution. He would have tried to run and hide. And what better place to run and hide than Olive Garden's endless soup and salad? Of course, you can say we're just making all this up. You're welcome to prove us wrong. No, you have no choice but to prove it. Because if you kill Makoto without proving your own innocence, you'll be accepting your own defeat. Damn. <laughs> well, She's good. You know, like, you know the Twitch chat for this? the stream in real life. It's like all the chat people in the chat are just like, KILL HER! KILL HER! Yeah. <laughs> KILL HER NOW! <laughs> Twitch streams can be cruel. <laughs> if you want to earn our despair fair and square, go over there, you little bear. <laughs> <laughs> now what you've suggested might be possible. It oh, would certainly yeah. make for one honey of a climax. <laughs> Does that mean you accept? You guys! If we do things your way, that'll be enough to convince you and the viewers, right? And it would cause you unbearable despair, right? Then I'm prepared to agree to your terms. You can't just don't keep using bear. Like, it's... Please. Switch it up. I, all our lives are on the line. <laughs> oh, but this is a long way to climax, right? Just guessing the killer is barely a fitting in. Dude, you gotta hire a writer Dude. or something. That's right, every last mystery that's pawing around the school. <laughs> if you can do that, then that'll be enough to qualify as a victory for okay. you. All right, qualify I was yeah. good. Was I, I really like that one. Yeah. Yeah, full credit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm done talking. I've got nothing left to say to you. So get lost, would you? Why so serious? <laughs> he seems emotionally unstable. Oh, is that right, world's greatest detective? <laughs> All right, so uh, we just had a little bit of a, a kerfuffle with Monokuma, and um, and now we're going to try to basically prove him wrong and uh, crack this case. You mean bear-sickly prove him wrong? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> but think of it another way. There must have been some reason they had, they had to do something that difficult. A reason? They had to show the world something, no matter the cost. Us killing each other. They wanted to show the world? The Mastermind has been very adamant about not killing us directly, but forcing us to kill each other. Makoto comes off in this conversation like somebody who's not listening, but just like, repeats the last thing that they heard to make yeah. it seem like the, they're listening. Yeah, there's a lot of like, looking at the phone and going, uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> forcing us to kill each other? Hmm. <laughs> But it looks like I got it right. This time, at least, I won the bet. She and let the bet out. is our lives. <laughs> <laughs> she let out a quick sigh. I took it as a no small sign of relief. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> she let out a little laugh. I took it as a small sign of appreciating the humor of the situation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. How pathetic. Step on me. <laughs> anyway, we, we can't relax just yet. <laughs> Wait, I can't step on you just yet. I do the doors. What's Yagfu? It's a hell of an email address. <laughs> Just email me, man. Uh, it's skurg at yagfu. 
<laughs> Yagfu.net. Uh. It was an expression of relief. Oh. Whoa! Is that Makoto? Oh. You guys! Oh, voice acting. It is! My friends, There's kind of. <laughs> yeah. The people I see regularly. You're here. <laughs> you survived? Jeez. You're like a stubborn little cockroach, you know that? Okay. I'm just asking Good to see to you too, sure, dick. But... Wait, what's that smell? Sorry, I've been farting ever since the ladder scene. What the heck? And yeah, and and you were in a trash heap. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man, that, that seriously stinks. <sighs> it's Makoto! He smells like a wet dog! <laughs> Oh, well, so sorry. I mean, I'm, I'm glad the excitement that I was alive lasted for 10 seconds. Yeah. Makoto isn't the killer. And of course, it's not me or any of you. Hmm? <laughs> is like, uh, right. Yeah. Uh, of none course, of, yeah. None of us killed her. S slowly puts the knife behind his back. <laughs> then who is it? What she's saying is, it was all the work of the mastermind. What? You're saying the mastermind killed Makuru? That's right. Yes. Yes, we just... just said that. I recall what you said at the end of the last trial. When you said... Here comes Peter Cottontail, hopping down the bunny trail. Hippity hop, hippity hop, hippity hop, splat. I knew that's what you were referring to. And of those 16 people we started out with, the only ones still alive are the people standing right here Need I continue, or do you get it now? Shut your fucking mouth. What? You say the mastermind is what it was? It's hero. Very good hero. It's 100% hero. I mean, that would be- that would be wild. He certainly would be the one you'd least suspect. Yeah. No way! Because he's it had the cognitive ability of a, of a snail this entire time. Yeah. You can't- I mean, I can just see it now, like the- the like change in his demeanor where he, he like lowers his, his face and like his eyes get all serious and he's like it was yeah. me all along of course of course if we're waxing theoretical right now hero is the, uh, the ultimate clairvoyant but he's a terrible clairvoyant <laughs> right so he's only right 30 percent of the time yeah and it's like okay either they're making a statement about the concept of clairvoyancy, or he's just a terrible clairvoyant, and he's really the mastermind. Mm. I don't know. How very magnanimous of him to unlock all the rooms. That's fine. The time for talk is done. Now we need to begin our investigation. <laughs> the time, the time, for, time talk. for talk is done, especially because I don't know what magnanimous means, so I'm <laughs> calling an end to this talk. Yeah. Onward, oh, to more good. conversations. Hina was in surprisingly high spirits as she dashed out of the dining hall to her death. And once again, it's just us two. Indeed. <laughs> that, that's them smooching extra hard. You hear uh, that squeaking in the background? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, we bought Camilla these little squeaky tennis balls. Um... <laughs> And she loves them, which is great, <laughs> but there have been drawbacks. <laughs> I have to do it. Oh, somebody's gonna have to be you there, like, whoa! Oh, damn. Okay, looks good. Bathroom. This is the girls' bathroom. Even in a place like bathroom. this, I can't bring myself to go in. Okay. What, what, do you think you're gonna run into a girl in there? <laughs> like, this is fucking place is abandoned. Can you grab one of the... Handbooks from the dead students uh, near the front door. I have no idea. Can't wait. Well, they're not even part of this because this is like a different class, I think, right? I know. I so know. I don't think any of theirs to, will make a difference. Just trying to think out loud. She must be thinking about something. I probably shouldn't bother her. Oh, okay. That's everybody at all times. <laughs> Oh, she seems really, like, perturbed by this whole situation. Probably shouldn't bother. She looks like she's breathing right now. She probably wants to concentrate on that. <laughs> the ultimate despair isn't one individual, but instead points to some kind of group. So in the end... That group is responsible for the tragedy- Did you say Sweden? <laughs> no, I said, so Parent? in the end. Oh, you dropped out. You know, I think like you the, might have said Sweden and then you froze. I think Dan froze on my computer. Oh, this is embarrassing. He's just looking at me with this face that's like... <laughs> oh, wait, you... There you go. <laughs> you just- you just came back. <laughs> what, what, what were you saying again? 
<laughs> no, no, it's okay. Let's move on. <laughs> All right. That must have been stupid. They're the worst sorts of people whose driving force comes from despair. However. Despair. <laughs> Anger is more useful than despair. <laughs> oh, by the way, I wanted to tell you. Um, remember how you told me that he doesn't do that in any Arnold Schwarzenegger movie? Oh, yeah. He does. I was watching Conan the Barbarian. Oh. And yeah, early on when he's fighting the guys uh, in the gladiator pit, he's like, oh, oh. <laughs> I was like, oh, Aaron's going to be so happy. <laughs> Didn't Monokuma say every door was unlocked? So why is that door locked? Yeah, maybe it's her dad behind the door. Oh. Anyway, She'll be so we... happy slash not happy to see him. <laughs> if you're worried about me, Makoto, don't be. I already know that your guess is wrong. Okay. In that case, here goes nothing. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. I collected myself, then turned to the face of the monitor. Let me just type the password here. I typed in her full name, Kyoko Kirigiri. My hands were tense, slightly trembling. Mom spaghetti. And as I finished <laughs> typing it in... <laughs> Beep kern. Oh, dip. What? Oh, dip. That did it? Kyoko, it worked. Your father does love you. Look how excited you are. Oh, okay. Wait, so you know what's in there? Yes, there's 30 to 40 unicycling clowns in there. <laughs> Just don't <laughs> scream or anything, okay? I always scream when I see clowns. Are you saying it's something that'll make me want to scream? Great deduction. Okay, I'm just gonna open it. It's... it's... late 90s techno! SOMEBODY SCREAM! I stole a hesitant glance and sighed and... <laughs> goo -wa. Kyoko's advice was no use. I let out a trembling cry. It's Whoa, bones. damn! What was in the box was the bones of a guy! Dun, dun, dun. My father. Oh, damn. He had great bones. Huh? What about him? What you found in the box. Those bones. That body. That's my father! Oh, you're finally reunited! <laughs> you, your chance to tell him all that's in your heart. <laughs> Maybe instead of a coffin, when I die, I'll just have my body folded up and stuffed into a delightfully wrapped present. Yeah. And then, you know? 10,000 years from now, archaeologists can find it and be like, Oh, fun! <laughs> I know Kyoko said she wanted to see her father so she could cut off all ties. But he can't even wear a tie as a skeleton. Yeah, it would- it would <laughs> fall like right through. <laughs> <laughs> but what was- what was that all there was to it? Remember when I farted on her? <laughs> and now he's abandoned me again. Stupid dead jerk. <laughs> and this time, he even stole the only opportunity I had to move on. Has there ever been a worse father? Yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Well, we're, we're getting to, we're getting to the bottom of this caper, mm. I do believe. Got a lot I don't of, know how. Got a lot of caperage to get through. Yeah. <laughs> I can't get any caperage. <laughs> this party sucks. Alright. <laughs> This murder sucks. <laughs> I can't get any damage. <laughs> Kyoko, it must have been a complete shock to her. I mean, it was a shock to me. I was like, dang, dem bones, dem bones, dem dry bones. My daughter, good to see you. <laughs> <laughs> I've He's missed like you. And so has the crack <laughs> on my <laughs> head. <laughs> Byakuya. Hero. What was her name? <laughs> Hina. And I'm gonna say Clark. <laughs> <laughs> and Kyoko. This locker is totally disorganized. It looks like Hero's locker. Hmm. Hmm. Oh yeah, it is a little mystical, isn't it? It's just a coincidence, right? It's not. I'm telling you, he did it. There's all kinds of- What if it's not- What if it's not just him? What mm. if a bunch of them are in on it? What if you and Kyoko are the only ones left who aren't evil? Wow. That would be amazing. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's a plan to turn Hope's Peak into a shelter and isolate the students here in a communal life. I decided to talk to the one who came up with the plan directly. It just so happens to be the headmaster and my father. <gasps> Holy crap. <gasps> 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 oh, Makoto, are you here to look around too? 
yeah, no, I wasn't just musing myself about the size of my wang. Is that what you're doing here? <laughs> yeah, I can't help but wonder about that Monokuma door. Yeah. So I figured, if all the doors at school had been unlocked, that one should be open too, right? Uh, Although I couldn't there's be just something. There's something about those words, Monokuma door, because it makes me think of like a humidor where you keep cigars. So like a Maca <laughs> A Monokuma door would be like a little refrigerated place where you keep all your bear robots. <laughs> I just wanted to check the Monokuma door. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it was, very, it was very humid in there. It was very Monokuma. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'll look at stuff. Was that like his little trap door? Some kind of hatch oh, on the floor. Yeah. Right now I'm more concerned about that weird device. Okay. Ra ra ra. Shish boom ba. <laughs> <laughs> Some kind of hatch on the floor. Right now, I need to check out the data center. Oh, okay. <laughs> Which means the mastermind has been controlling Monokuma from this room. Yeah, they were that definitely. Actually, that makes me think it really might be multiple people because I can't think of any one person who wasn't around every time Monokuma showed up. You know what I mean? Hmm. I mean, there were times. Really? Because I feel like there were times where we were like all in the gym. Well, also the trials. We were all there for the trials, except for Mukuro. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, maybe, maybe... Maybe it was Mukuro for the first part, and then someone else took over... ...afterwards. Oh, oh man, I don't know. Yeah. The mastermind has been that control... Would, Ma that would, I'm sorry, that would also make sense, because... ...we don't know who killed Mukuro. Oh, that's so true. So it was probably the, the other mastermind who, uh... ...who took him out. Shit, man. Shit, yeah, man. wow. This is... This is interesting. Maybe it's someone who died early on. Like, uh... Like Junko, or... Like, who was the first death? Was it... The first death was Sayaka. Sayaka. Maybe it's a Sayaka! Mamma <laughs> 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 mia, I'm a Monokuma! So, like... So, um... You wanna leave? So, you wanna make out? That's, oh. So, right now you're being operated by someone in that room? Yes! Correct, Amando. But that doesn't make any sense. We were just in there and didn't see anyone. <laughs> oh, you didn't, did you? <laughs> Are you sure you weren't just there as you could have been? <laughs> oh, the hatch that the game told me not to pay attention to. Ah! Uh. Did you happen to check a certain suspicious hatch? No way. The hatch on the floor. Yes, the hatch <laughs> on the floor. You fucking moron. God damn it, I checked it like three times! You came to the right place this time. Would you like to see something interesting? <laughs> um... No. I've seen this movie before. <laughs> yeah. Anthony! <laughs> Did that one get you? Why when I'm drinking? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Gotta have that big byakya of yours. <laughs> oh, service. again with the drinking! Oh, okay. <laughs> Full service. <laughs> okay. It was on top of that pathetically ostentatious desk. Oh, shut Damn, your dude. God. Boy, you are just so hateful towards everything. <laughs> yeah. The desk is like, come on, man. Yeah. Cl <laughs> Class 7. The desk was student. sitting on that stupid floor in, in front of those shitty fucking <laughs> asshole curtains. <laughs> <laughs> Class 78 student <laughs> registry. Mukuro right. reappeared suddenly and in the background of entity and in the background an entity floats close but just out of reach. What? Yeah. There's another important bit of information within the file that you should note. What is it? Why don't you turn to page three? <laughs> and it just it's just a picture of like a monkey and with the words <laughs> fuck you underneath. <laughs> <laughs> Gotti! Gotti! <laughs> he just like runs out. <laughs> Five foot seven inches, 97 pounds, and even lists her vitals. 31, 22, 32. Okay, thanks, weirdo. Only if she's 5'3. Whoosh, whoosh, you can do side bends or sit ups, but please don't lose that butt. And you're like, Byakya! <laughs> like, oh, sorry. What's gotten into you, Byakya? <laughs> Well, what do you think? <laughs> Sorry, go ahead and turn to page three. <laughs> <laughs> you hopeless idiot. What I'm trying to tell you is maybe you'll want to keep that in mind for later. Oh, okay. Would you J.O. to these files? <laughs> yeah, like, fucking... 
All right, Bianca. Jesus, I guess I'll yeah, leave. I, I don't have time to waste on you right now. If you didn't notice, I had my shoulders crossed and I was looking into the middle distance. I'm extremely busy. <laughs> if you absolutely must talk, go do it at someone else. Bitch, go take a shit. <laughs> <laughs> God, he's so blunt. Just makes you feel hopeless. <laughs> Wait, is that a <laughs> is that a quote from something? Yeah, bitch, you need to go take a shit. <laughs> <gasps> What's that from? Is that from RuPaul's Drag Race or something? No, it's from a fucking cartoon. It just sounded like the type of like snarky thing that they would say on that show. <laughs> He just reminded me, I went out to pick up some food yesterday, and I just like, there was a car parked next to me. And I got out of the car and I put my mask on, and then I just like turned, and, and right in the car, sitting in the driver's seat, was just this dude with this giant bong. He just takes this like, outrageous <laughs> rip on it. <laughs> and I was like, that's not safe. All right. <laughs> Uh, I, yeah, <laughs> so he was he was in his car. You said <laughs> yes. I mean, you can't you can't. Well, I mean, whatever. I shouldn't criticize. I smoked for a long time, but <laughs> man, bong rips and then driving. I don't know, dude. <laughs> it's so funny. There's some kind of weird machine on the left side. A bunch of glowing lights, but only some of the lights are on. The ones on the left, <gasps> the right oh, hand crap. lights are off. So wait, how many are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, okay. I thought it was gonna give a clue to how many students are still supposed to die. Oh, I in see. all this. Which would mean inside each slot lit up in blue, another one of the victims is nice. <laughs> no, dead. <laughs> <laughs> it's not nice at all. <laughs> I can't let my emotions take control right now. There's only one thing I can do for everyone who's died. And that's defeat the mastermind. And to do that, I have to continue my- Meanwhile, they're all in there like, pff, 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 help! <laughs> like, the only thing I can do is defeat the mastermind. <laughs> Let me out of here. Like, I must avenge their deaths. <laughs> I'm alive. We're all alive. All right, I'm leaving now. Out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. And to do that, I have to continue my investigation. I don't have any other option. None whatsoever. Please, God, we're freezing alive! <laughs> Maybe the body is inside the tool shed. I better check just to be sure. Maybe they fed it to the man-eating plant. <laughs> yeah. I feel at home here. Because he's- because he's a tool, I don't know. Because I didn't he's find a tool, anything. got it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what I found was a single photograph. Duh! What the heck? It featured a bunch of faces I recognized extremely well. It was everyone who'd come to Hope's Peak at the same time as me. Oh, and Mukuro's Boy, in there that, too. Yeah, yeah, that is everybody. Maybe the headmaster is every other student but you. That, I mean, that's certainly the possibility. Um, they're such a cute bunch too. Yeah. I really like them. Oh my god, what if that's... Um... What if that's the game? It's not who can survive, it's who can, uh... Like, who can be the one to implicate you or something like that like yeah maybe they're maybe they're all trying to see if they can turn you into a murder maybe That'd that's the, maybe that's hope's, hope's peaks game is to get all the ultimate prodigies together to take out a non-ultimate prodigy oh man see if the ultimate prodigy can out prodigy the prodigies so, yeah so many oh and then if you do it you get to join them whoa oh, crap. oh. The oh ultimate, that's what and I, that's the ultimate hope yeah <laughs> That's what I would- oh man. I would really want that because that would mean everyone is alive and I like all these characters. I've got a lot of questions. So in the end, all I found in the gym was even more confusion. And with so that in the end. <laughs> with that confusion in hand, I left the gym dejected. Dejected, rejected, getting in the building and protected. How does this count as a hint? It just made me even more confused. <laughs> Just sick freestyling. Where, where did you come up? On the streets of Brooklyn, Aaron? <laughs> Detected. Rejected. Protected. <laughs> like everyone behind you listening is like, oh! 
some shit. <laughs> Togo, are you okay? No, Noko. She's not dead, is she? Oh. Can you see what's happening on Discord right now? Oh yeah. My 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 dog. She she needs to go out. Um, <laughs> she can she can definitely wait. Uh, like fifteen more minutes, but. Um, she has decided to stand directly in front of the computer screen, <laughs> blocking everything in my sight, and just looking at me. <laughs> right, the way you said right my now. dog reminded me of like, please, my dog. She's very ill. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. I'll just- I'll just scratch her butt and-, and that, that'll- Oh, oh, she likes that. She's like, whoa. Yeah, she, that's she's like, whoa. Oh, sick. <laughs> she's doing that thing whoa. where like she doesn't know how to deal with it. She's like, oh, oh, I like it. I, I just, oh. <laughs> yeah, she, she gets super happy. So when someone's in there, the blue light comes on. Looking around, the number of lights that are on, including Mukuro's, that's nine in all. Nine. Nine lights? Nine? <laughs> oh, okay. We it's yeah, ten. how many students should have died by now? Ten, right? Ten? Is that true? Well, let's go through it. Sayaka. Wait, hold on. Leon. There's, we literally uh, have a list of people. Uh, Dead. Oh, yeah, yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's and it. Nine plus Makuro. Um, well, plus Makuro. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Well, so I mean, I guess Mondo was turned into Mondo Butter. <laughs> that is true. Yeah, he's just like in like a mini fridge. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Makoto, I'm done. <laughs> what a meal that was. What? <laughs> the body's gone. <laughs> mm. <laughs> the only other option is those other wounds, but the file said they were old. Where does it say they're old? Because huh? All the Monokuma file says is that they were inflicted at least several days ago. I guess I don't see the oh, difference. They killed the person and then brought the body out. Ah. Well, the difference is immense considering the impression they give. Listen. You seem to be equating several days old with simply old. However. But that doesn't quite follow logically. So it could be somebody that was already dead that we knew who was dead. Yes, just got dragged out. Yeah. Old wounds. It makes it sound like they've been there forever. Like they're not related to the murder. Are you saying they are? But we all got the Monokuma file right after she was killed, right? I bet it's Junko. Oh man, that would be random. <laughs> so if there's anything else you'd like to know about the condition of the body, now's the time. Oh, uh, what condition was it in? A bad one. Thick. Come to think of it, there was one thing. None of this makes sense right now, but I guess that means there's some important clue on this deep weed. Okay, I'm going to make a prediction. Okay. And it's going to make no sense. Okay. Everyone was invited. Mm hmm And then during the time that you were like passed out and don't remember, like you just woke up at a desk. Yeah. Uh, you guys went through the full experience of being in a class together for a year, and something horrible happened, and then you woke up, and now you are the... You are... Like, that that class that all the destruction and terrible things happened to, uh, was your class from a year ago, and you just... None of you remember it, because you were all brain brainwashed or something, uh, and then... You're all ghosts! <laughs> Dan. And now it's my turn. <laughs> Dan... I, uh, yes, sir. The way that this game thinks, I that that's not even like uh, it's like oh yeah probably. <laughs> yeah, it could, it could be. I mean, who even knows? There's only one thing you need to know when you're here, your family. <laughs> Just like my father, whether it's the greatest truth or the worst. <laughs> what do you mean? Even if the truth you uncover is filled with hopelessness. <laughs> what are you saying? It's over between us. Wait, we were <laughs> dating? Fuck! <laughs> I took the, Kyo the DVD Kyoko gave me and put it in the player. Ultimate late 90s mix. Alien Ant Farm. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not- Hey, you're okay! <laughs> <laughs> it's, 
It's and no, and no other song. I don't. I don't know any other. <laughs> yeah. Smooth Criminal by Alien Ant Farm ten times, and then the live version of Alien Ant Farm Smooth Criminal. <gasps> Whoa, S Sayaka! It took me by total surprise. I hadn't seen Sayaka in who knows how long. Days. Two weeks. <laughs> there, then there she was. Okay, then. Exactly two weeks. Yeah. There is a chance that you may have to spend the rest of your life here in the school. Oh, cool. Well, that's that's the fun. good news is that'll only be three weeks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no particular reason for that or anything. <laughs> you, you, you want me to accept that? Yes. Oh yes! wow! Yeah. Yes. Oh, jeez. Talk about like a, a, a lost gem coming back home. <laughs> Sayaka was obviously at a total loss. It made total sense. Who would agree to spending the rest of your life in this school? And when the conversation isn't about pasta for zoo, well, she doesn't know what to say. As the headmaster of Hope's Peak Academy, ah. I give you my word. Ah. Whoa! And if I was confused before, oh god, <laughs> what I saw next pushed me right over the edge. Whoa! <laughs> What? Huh? What I saw was me! Impossibly, undeniably me! So, Makoto, before we begin, I should let you know that I'll be recording our conversation. Yes. <laughs> Dude, I had a feeling something weird happened during that stretch of, you know, unconscious time before yeah. we woke up at his desk. But I, the I in the here and now, had absolutely no memory of it! I had no memory of even meeting the headmaster, much So less if we did gay stuff, it doesn't count! <laughs> Byakuya! Uh, what's her name? <laughs> Tiny hands toke nuts. Justice Kyoko's here if you would wrap it up! Wrap it, wrap it, wrap it, wrap it up. <laughs> <laughs> Just as the interview was wrapping up, so where do you see yourself in five years? At this fucking school! <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Uh, I'll protect you or whatever. Yeah, Failure my ass! Oh, Makoto, what the fuck? <laughs> Dude. You... There's nothing worse than ass failure. <laughs> you cut the power on purpose. Well, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Even if I watch the I'm whole thing, it. it'd just be more of the same. He'd ask- he'd ask them the question and they'd all say yes. <laughs> then you, you run into Kyoko and she's like, But you got to the last part, right? It's like, FUCK! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You oh. know the part that turns everything on its head? <laughs> Every end is the promise of a new beginning! Which what is, is this, a semi-sonic song? We'll <laughs> I wanna put my tender heart in a blender! <laughs> Closing time! <laughs> Open up the doors and let you out into the world! Anyway, let's get started! <laughs> let's get started watching it spin round to a beautiful oblivion! The beginning of the end of the class trial! Everyone okay. once again I'm, a, I'm aware that, uh, that beautiful oblivion is not a semi-sonic song. I, c I couldn't hear you because you cut out from mumblage. I said I'm aware that Beautiful Oblivion isn't a semi-sonic song. It's Eve 6. That's neither here nor there. Okay, I- yeah, I wasn't coming down on you, man. Oh, so that's how Poo Hoo Hoo sounds. That's an Eve 6 song. Fucking asshole. <laughs> God damn it. I made a semi-sonic I bet you wouldn't even swallow the rind. <laughs> <laughs> Rendezvous, now I'm through with you. <laughs> okay. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Salad Mask is so wonderful, so cool, so hot, my lords are ablaze. Now listen why, to uh, why do you have to be the one person that talks? <laughs> Everything will be just fine if you leave it to me. My with my scissor sharp scissors in hand. I- what? <laughs> Yeah. How's Tab and Gouge and Shiv the Master of Evil? But I thought you couldn't kill anyone but adorable little boys. <laughs> if it's what Master wants, it could be boy, girl, or anything in between. I can handle it. It's you. <laughs> Where am I? Uh, 
every time, every time in her, it doesn't matter which personality it is, every time a new one makes an appearance, I want to be like, BOOM! <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. I was just gonna say, like, I don't know if I was happy or upset that you chased back to Toko. I'm gonna win this game super fair and square! Today, I'm and I'll make sure everyone fight. watching at home knows that despair is mightier than the hope. <laughs> They're not living the life. <laughs> and of course, waiting for the loser is the super exciting, super hard pounding punishment. Are you saying that if you Hero and Owie are like, can we move our seats, please? <laughs> yeah. A little too close for comfort here. Yeah, bears never go back on their word. That mm. is not a commonly accepted thought. <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna eat you. <laughs> Never mind all that. I've seen what you I do with picnic baskets. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna steal that picnic basket. <laughs> it smells like peanut butter and honey, though. I have evidence, too. What? You, too? Well, why would I be the one that it makes him go like that? The evidence you're all referring yeah. to is this group photo, right? Photoshop is well, easy. Well, yeah. <laughs> huh? Wait, but mine's different. Yeah, you're With missing in yours. You have, I'm in it. I want to see the Makoto one. Was I flicking the camera? Yeah, I was like, yeah, and my picture is just a picture of a monkey pissing into his own face. <laughs> <laughs> Proof that you're all against me. <laughs> pretty important evidence. Now you can see the piss is going into the monkey's own face. <laughs> <laughs> Proof I need to reveal Monokuma's trap. I mean, look around you, dude. <laughs> like, what proof do you need? Each photo has a certain something in common. There's a connection regarding what person isn't shown in the group photos. Like, do you really need me to weigh in on this? <laughs> the ones who got the... What, what? That's the whole impetus of this entire scene! <laughs> this scene wouldn't make any sense if you didn't already understand that! <laughs> Jesus. As long as we're talking about it, I suppose I should show you my photo as well. <laughs> Two monkeys. <laughs> I love Sakura. What? what? Did you see that? <laughs> Did you see Sakura punching yes. a giant fish out of the water? This is the best, man. Can I see everyone's group photo one more time? It's not directly connected to what we're Starts crossing about, his eyes like, what's like missing from this picture that's in this picture? <laughs> sure, no problem. Ugh, I was so good at these I've when I read it. highlights. Yeah, I don't mind. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's like one of those magic eye things. I just have to overlay it. What's missing from this picture? I've got it. The person who has the picture isn't in the photo. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's like, oh! <laughs> Monokuma's like, how'd you figure that one out? Can you just forget about the photo already? Yeah. What even does, what even does that have to do with anything? <laughs> yeah. What does it have to do with my monkey and how aggressively he's pissing on his own face? <laughs> I'm just as pissed about that as the monkey is about his face. Damn. Do, do you do you know that um I don't I don't know if YouTube is his main platform. He's a very funny comedian of Asian descent and he does like little little vignettes about um uh video games and stuff somehow we'd all I'll have to look up his name but he could he was making fun it, of this it? game basically and, pros ed uh, that might be him that might be him yeah i and, was on his podcast like a like like were you two really weeks ago yeah that's that's very cool he's got like a deep voice yes he's a very talented so voice he, actor yeah very funny um he I, I saw some video of his in regards to this game where it's like it appears that Sayaka was- it, they're in the trial and it's like, it appears Sayaka was stabbed with a knife. <laughs> and then he puts on like a Monokuma mask and he's like, But can you spell knife?! <laughs> it's, like, it's, it's like, yeah, that is weird, isn't it? <laughs> I need the letter K. Make sure you pick the right letter! I need the letter K. And if different letters touch, they explode! There is no K You here. need to make a comic book after this! You're saying we all got- <laughs>
Since when is this? Since when is this? Since when is this? It's great that you can do a, a, a comedic speed up of their voice in a very sick- Oh, come on! <laughs> it was still on the screen when the entirety of the word went away! Why not do the slowdown? Because it's- I don't know. <laughs> like, forget which buttons it is. That's a very honest answer, and I appreciate it. I appreciate you fighting your first instinct to just say whatever. <laughs> Shoot it. Damn it! <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> Go! This shit sucks so bad. This is probably the worst part of this game is this shit. But this is the only really gamey part. I know. Fuck, fuck! No, that's not the- No! No, I didn't want to absorb it! For fuck's sake! This shit sucks ass! Alright, uh... Interview DVD- No! I can't go back! There's only one button to cycle through them! <laughs> alright, 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 alright. Okay, here we go. You got it? Yes. Slow down is the right trigger. <laughs> and then. Totally got it. Slow down is the. Uh... Fuck! No! Motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> what a shit show. I can't believe this! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here it is. Oh Alright, slow okay. it down, shoot the thing, shoot the bullet. Jesus. Yay! Just watch the DVD and you'll see for yourself. Alright, everybody, let's take five and watch the DVD. The headmaster did, in fact, interview you. And you look particularly vacant. <laughs> yes! Think about that. I know it sounds absurd, but... If it's the truth, there's nothing we can do about it. Indeed. But is it we insane in the membrane? In <laughs> uh, no, it's insane in the brain. <laughs> really? yep. you all totally lost your memory at the same time. <laughs> Here's like, can I maybe not sit on the side of the bear with the crazy teeth? <laughs> there's no question that the mastermind is somewhere within the school. Oh. How do you know? Did you find some Camera's moving in too close. <laughs> my cock! <laughs> Give it back! I'll take my cock back. <laughs> How'd they manage to survive all of this? Oh. Be somewhere else? So we're the only ones here? It's not me. I'm not the mastermind. You know what, hero? I think we could pretty much rest assured that you're telling the truth on that one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where would I put that gigantic brain that a mastermind would need? <laughs> well, it's not me. I like it zooms into his head and it's just like a 1972 game of Pong. I think good. What are you trying to say? Everyone, I mean they just calm said it. Down. There's no reason to panic. Yeah. What are you trying to say with the words that are exactly what you're saying? The mastermind's true identity will be You're the murderer. What? <laughs> what do you even you mean? Out, <laughs> Isn't it obvious? She was the ultimate soldier, right? So that means y you know, you're wrong. Oh. <laughs> I'm supposed to say that. You denied me. <laughs> Before I could even say anything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Her reactions to things are not my favorite. <laughs> yeah. So, in this scene, you're gonna have to be... <sighs> I don't even know how to explain it. <laughs> okay, so when someone tells you you're wrong, be sure to giggle, blush, drool, <laughs> and pass out. And then scream, and perhaps turn into a schizophrenic murderer. <laughs> okay! When she entered the school, she hadn't sustained a single injury. Right, right. Oh, he did not so completely. Actually, it's kind of refreshing. Okay, dude. Oh, maybe oh, yeah. it's because of all of Master's training. Love her character. <laughs> so uh, then, what about the little matter of what happened last night? What's he talking about? Yeah, I don't know. He, uh... <laughs> so what about the little matter of what happened last night? You know... When I 
when I plunged my wiener in a bottle of marinara sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just remembered a quote from Game Grumps that was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> I just watched the Sonic anime where he says my cock a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the right hand? Yes. Oh hand? yeah, because it didn't have the tattoo on it. Maybe the right foot. Or perhaps the left foot. <laughs> I thought it said piss for a second. Yeah. Uh, no, the hips would never lie. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you the one thing that proves beyond a shadow of a doubt it wasn't me. I'll spell the word innocent. <laughs> also, I've got quite a pencil neck, really wouldn't you say? <laughs> <laughs> I thought his head just like... <laughs> Yeah, it, it, it looks like his head is like growing out of it, like... <laughs> <laughs> I noticed that some text had been stamped on one corner of the tarp. Oh, it says Biolab. Exactly. <laughs> Owned by Biolab Baggins of Bag End <laughs> from The Hobbit. <laughs> Holy cow! How'd you notice that tiny little thing? Hobbits, yes, they are quite small. <laughs> now that the conversation has turned to the topic of the bio lab, you must be getting pretty nervous. <gasps> no, I'm not. The key to uncovering your secret identity is hidden within that room, isn't it? Definitely not. Is he the Hobbit? <laughs> <laughs> you see. Of course, only a Hobbit could fit in that bear costume. <laughs> one so major, it can't be Let's get it off of him and find out once and for all. <laughs> It, it, like, immediately explodes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Hero's dead. Let's move on. <laughs> Why are you bringing that up now? Your I don't mom, know. your dad, your little sister. What do you think has happened to your family? Well, clearly they fucked up that couch and left. <laughs> yeah. As safe as you might have assumed? I don't think he assumed that they were safe. Stop yeah. Stop talking about that. Calm down, Lakota. He wants you to get upset. He's using your fear to power his monster city. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I need to calm down. I the sentence I just said was very stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I need to calm down. I can't let him get to me. He's just saying that because he knows we're getting close to the truth of the bio lab. So if I want him to shut up, I've got to shut him up with facts. And reason. The inconsistency. And this. <laughs> <laughs> that one. All right, Makoto's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on. Final strike. Final strike. It is little bear butt. Oh, it's the wrong bullet. This should prove it. Yeah, this should prove it. The lights, I guess. Nine lights doesn't make sense. The number of lights should be ten. Right. Oh shit. I gotta think it out. Uh. Should be ten. Uh, yeah. I think we talked about it earlier. We did, I just had to count it in my head. Any other number is incredibly suspicious. Suspicious? That's simple. Um just recall who's died here. I don't understand! If each morgue is a dead body and there's only nine lights, what does that imply? Same person was killed twice. I got it. Yeah, sense. I mean, that's what, what they're saying about, about Makuro. The same person was killed twice. Oh. Killed twice? Officially, ten murders have been committed Oh, so didn't far. I call it? Didn't I say Makuro's body was Junko? I think I said that. Oh, boy. But one of the victims may have been murdered. And then murdered again. Murdered and... Murdered again? Yes, because that's all the stab wounds. That's how Junko died. Uh, oh, oh Aaron! Only nine victims, right? You clever girl. Ha <laughs> ha <laughs> So Mukuro is the mastermind? No, no, no. There's no way anyone was murdered. <laughs> No. Fuck you, bear! <laughs> <laughs> Just starts punching it in the gut, like. <laughs> <laughs> mm. well, nope, so she died. What happened to her? She was impaled by a bunch of spears all over her body. 
and Mukuro died from a number of wounds across her body. <sighs> there, there's got to be some connection here. <laughs> <laughs> but but wait. The body had the tattoo Juko on the hand, didn't it? Going by that name the, yeah, but I mean, you can fake that. Spears. Oh, okay, it was faked. I would assume so. Then okay. her body was kept in the bio lab for however long before being dragged out again. Uh huh. Only this time, it was presented as the corpse of one. Yeah, and she had those. Uh, she had those long nails. Oh, that, yes. a, that the right. ultimate soldier would never those be caught dead wearing. <laughs> <laughs> so gauche. That's right. She made it look like Junko's so the mastermind's true identity is. Wait, so say, Monokuma, is it Junko actually Mukuro Ikusaba? That that's what we're trying to figure out. Wait, so is the implication that Junko was actually Mukuro Ikusaba? It's just that one of the other students who we thought was dead is the actual mastermind. No, I think I think the and game is implying alive? that Mukuro Ikusaba is yeah, Junko. Right. It's possible. Like body was her. The way that they're like the phrasing it with her right being like the wrong one and me having to like contradict her. Say, well, go for it then. Shoot, shoot, shoot something. She was five foot six inches tall and weighed. Oh, that's right. Yes, they got very specific about it. So I guess she would be caught dead wearing 32. those nails. <laughs> Everything in her profile is consistent with that corpse. And then there's the matter of the Fenrir tattoo. So there's no question it's her. Okay. That's what I said. But you Mukuro's scoffed at me. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're both right. <laughs> if I can. <laughs> Junko is still alive. It's the only possibility. Oh, man. Are you sure about that? Huh? I admit, since Mukuro is on. I guess Junko's dead, the only one that Junko was killed by the, the mastermind directly. Yeah. And it was done to, like, prove a point that helps the mastermind's case. Like, hers was like the everybody stay in line kind of death. Yeah. The two of them may have switched places from the very beginning. What? From the beginning? From the beginning? Yes. From the yes. beginning. From the moment we first met. <laughs> I don't understand. Oh, could someone explain this to me? <sighs> Wait, but Mukuro had a tattoo on the back of her hand, right? No, yes. Right, <laughs> yes. Junko never had any tattoo like that, did she? <laughs> this was the only frame we had of her with her hand up like that. <laughs> You know, for me, who sees and hears everything at a slight lag and different amount of time because of Discord, the idea that you're acing this looks so incredible to me. <laughs> He's a fucking master! <laughs> Even though it's completely off, he's still nailing it! <laughs> the unusual circumstance common to all these pictures. Junko's face is covered up in each one? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, she's oh always yeah, she's away. turned away. Oh yeah, look at that. The unusual circumstances. Junko's face. We were so absorbed with what, what Celeste was wearing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll prove everything right now. Damn, everything, eh? Right here, right now. Oh. Closing argument. Damn. Oh, fuck, I hate these. Oh, sick. Look at this. It's time. She wanted us to believe the murder had only recently taken place. Yeah. But then she went into the Mon broken Monokuma and took the bomb from the Monokuma's body or whatever. We'll just gloss over that. Tick, click, boom! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. By strapping a bomb to the body, and it's very much less successful follow-up. Pop, pop! <laughs> <laughs> Double, double on the radio, double on the stereo. <laughs> pop, pop. <laughs> and the one who carried it all out is the true mastermind, the one controlling Monokuma. And it's Junko. <laughs> the real Junko and Oshima. Damn. Ain't this some shit? Yes. I did not have that. Yeah, I did not have that pegged at all. Give it up, Junko. The game's over. Over. <gasps> <laughs> did you really think the story would end once we reached the climax of the Oh case? fuck! Chapter seven. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong. There's 
still plenty more to go. Oh, fuck me. 30 hours of gameplay, to be exact. <laughs> oh! <laughs> plenty more to go. Plenty more to go. Plenty more to go? Yeah, it'll be 30 hours of everyone repeating what I say. Oh, wow. well, she looks exactly like the other. She looks exactly like Mukuro. <laughs> She's the same exact eyes. Well, no, Muk Mukuro is. Oh, yeah, same exact eyes, yeah. We have been waiting. Waiting so very long for peasants like you to appear. Wait, so oh, and apparently she's an 18th century queen. Yeah. If you swear your fealty to us, we will reward you with half of the entire world. What the fuck is going on? We've even drawn I don't know. I guess I'm just upset that they didn't do a good job, like, conveying that. Because she looks exactly like when Mukuro was being her. So it's like I wouldn't I wouldn't she, have been able to put two and two close. together. Because yeah, they were like, it doesn't quite match up, and it's like, how not? They look the same. <laughs> anyway. She tried her best. But there's just no way she could have passed as the ultimate fashionista. Oh, and you I, I would say that a, a certain amount of suspension of disbelief is going to be required to enjoy this game fully. <laughs> yeah. Not even if they're twins. What? I know. Oh! I'm almost embarrassed to admit it. So basically, Mukuro and I had your stereotypical twin relationship. Okay. Younger Different last sister, names? Tough and proud. That was Mukuro. Younger sister, smart and cute. That was. <laughs> Me! Junko fucking Anishima! Wait, if, if one's older and one's younger, then you can't be twins. They're not twins. <laughs> And why would one of you be older? Yeah. Other than like a minute. Maybe it's new to your dumbass, but it pours me to tears. Answering the same questions over and over? Just make up whatever answer you want. I don't give a shit. The truth's fucking lame anyway. Damn. Girl! <laughs> yeah, Juco's cool. <laughs> means... It was atrociously clear just how out of touch she was with the rest of society. Meanwhile. My ultimate fashionista status has an undeniable appeal that I didn't want to go to waste. And that's... why you switched identities? This is absurd. Yeah. Sadly, <laughs> there's no way Mukuro could have pulled off such a convincing performance. But she did teach you all a very valuable lesson, don't you think? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> You're not that cool. I don't think I'm gonna date you now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I thought you were like really me? awesome, and now I'm like, ugh. What? I sacrificed her? That's what's got you so hot under the collar? It's never gonna work between us. I'm a Virgo, and you're a fucking killer. <laughs> that act is filled with so much despair. You can't help but put a super in front of it. It's like. He was like, are you gonna eat those mushrooms? Super, super, super despair. <laughs> Super, 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 super despair. Um, could you do that line again? You missed a super. I really do think that they were getting paid by the word when they made this game. I don't think there's anything perfect about anything you just said. Unless you're saying it's perfectly bananas. Master's way more perfect. Because on top of everything else, he's got that noble blood. He's got, he's got that boom boom pow! <laughs> <laughs> the second motive? What was the second murder? The weird envelopes. Oh, the weird envelopes. That was like suspicion. Oh, fear. Oh, yeah, the threat of the past. Yep. I got it! Was the theme was bedwetting. Right? Everyone's like, what? <laughs> uh, I mean, uh, uh, what was yours? <laughs> if none of you wanted to escape this school, the killings never would have taken place. That is why we took your memories, so that you would have the desire to leave. The only reason we want to leave is because you took our memories. Is that yes. what you're saying? That's what she just said. <laughs> like, just, just said it. No, that's not what I'm saying at all. <laughs> Correct mundo. Which means if we did have our memories, then we wouldn't want to leave. Uh, Do I understand yes. that right? <laughs> yes! 
Wait a s- hold on a second here. Are whoa, you meaning whoa. to tell me that if we didn't not have our memories, that we would not want to leave? So, I let me take this from the top. <laughs> if we didn't not, leave. not, not, not have our memories, <laughs> wouldn't we not want to not ever want to not leave? <laughs> One plus one is two <laughs> plus three. Yes! <laughs> I want more distress! More despair! Is is this is this more like the village? Onion, please! <laughs> <laughs> so just like Crazy Eddie slashing his prices and what? the savings on to you, let me give you a hint. Crazy Eddie? <laughs> Th yeah. That's like a oh, local oh, New Jersey oh, That is bizarre. <laughs> Maybe, uh, maybe the, the localizer was a, like a New Jersey born. Yeah, or New York, New York City. But I don't think there were Crazy Eddies like all over the place. Wow. Boy, that's wild. That's crazy. That's as insane as his prices. <laughs> Behold, the world beyond the school walls. This is the outside world. Okay, God, okay, Jesus. Okay, Open come, the fucking come, door. Shit, my Find lord. Only four more ways to say it. What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what? Oh, this is silly. Yeah, this is ridiculous. Are you telling me to swap places with her? No! Absolutely not! That'd be like forfeiting my What are you talking about? It happens three times a day! <laughs> Lunch? That would be like forfeiting my entire hunger! <laughs> okay, so this big, awful, tragic event, they started just calling it the tragedy, happened about a year ago. It was so big and so bad that even this murderous fiend went pale at the sight of it. I guess they're putting all these cartoon bears on everything! <laughs> <laughs> It's like, Ugh, when you're getting rare. really tired in SimCity 2000, and you're like, fuck it, and you just summon the aliens? That's what it's like. <laughs> you bit into it like a middle-aged secretary at an all-you-can-eat cake buffet. Who cares? Hey, hey, That's so, very what presumptuous. To the Togami family? Um... I can't say. Third one. Correct! Well done, peasant! Wow. But I didn't say anything yet. I just got so fucking bored waiting, I couldn't help it! Alright, language, first Even of all. Wrong, eventually <laughs> Yakuya's entire lineage has been totally annihilated! It's kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's terrible, but... It's the fact that he's so arrogant about it, and then it's just like, ah, you, you, you you're nothing. Hell, there is no world anymore, remember? <laughs> it got fucked a full year ago! Oh, uh, that doesn't make any sense. Huh? I don't make sense. There's no way that happened a year ago. Because... Because... Metal Gear Solid 2 came out a year ago! <laughs> <laughs> and I haven't even played it yet! <laughs> You're saying that what happened two years ago actually happened more recently, right? Huh? Two years ago? Well, I mean, I mean wouldn't they look different if they were two years two older? Years yeah. Like when you're 15 to 17, like that's a big difference. It's, yeah. That's impossible. I mean, I haven't gone to any awesome school events or anything. <laughs> no, <laughs> you're wrong. <laughs> yeah. You were at the book fair. <laughs> 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 Yeah. No, you're wrong! Hasn't this whole thing been awesome? Oh, oh hold on, hold no, on. Yeah, you okay? My... I could never lose something like that. <laughs> Can you see what's happening over here? Yeah, I see a, I see a big dog butt. <laughs> she climbed right up and just knocked the microphone out of my hand. Hero, there's something I'd like you to take a look at. <laughs> this notebook right here. Oh, oh god, a notebook. Thank you. Whew. Jeez. Huh? Hey, why is my name written on it? 
Because it's yours, you- I never went to a single club! <laughs> <laughs> this is in the locker room on the second floor. <laughs> no, you're wrong! Do <laughs> you laugh at the dog? Yes. <laughs> Just a giant dog face in the webcam. <laughs> For the first time. No one can remember that time I farted. <laughs> that's what that's what this is all about. <laughs> she destroyed the world and erased everyone's memory so they wouldn't remember her fart. <laughs> and it just lets other. it slip. She's like, fuck! Alright, let's start over. <laughs> you were all such close friends. You spent two years together, and then you started killing each other. And it was all so you could escape into a world that's already been annihilated! Boy, this is a downer. <laughs> An event unfolded that hammered a soul-crushing despair into all of humanity. And what was that? Yeah, explain it. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. Right. The tragedy. Yeah. Do you happen to have three pictures of it? <laughs> so you just used us? To bring despair to everyone in the outside world? Well, sure, but I also God, it's even worse than the chance first six times right? you said that. <laughs> it's like, give and take. Give and take? You're so full of shit. Damn. Oh, it did it? Was it? Did he it take said it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he finally cracks. He's like, this is a bunch of poo. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he said it! He's really mad! <laughs> oh my god, you pushed Makoto to the edge! <laughs> All those motives I talked about were totally meaningless. I mean, with the world having ended and all. Meaningless? Then we... Jeez Louise. Been murdering each other? For nothing? Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm, I'm sorry, Hina. Did that just occur to you now? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. And while we're on the subject, what happened to the last two years of my memories? <laughs> but I'm sorry to say, begging doesn't Just work on bonk me. her on the head, man. You're right there. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Kick her in the groin and bonk her on the head. <laughs> Boom. And then we'll get her, her little the little lump that whoop, and then a little Tweety Bird, <laughs> you know. <laughs> like, yeah. And then throw her in the trash compactor. <laughs> Hilarious deaths have changed a little bit since the Looney Tunes days. I simply gave you a little nudge in the right direction. I want to play a game. And, and threatened your life. Yeah. Some people are so ungrateful for the hope that they have. But not you. Not anymore. But we don't have much time left to keep up this banter. We have to draw things to a close soon. Thank yeah. fucking God. Yeah. We won't give up. Well, that's a lot of ones. Hope, we'll never give up. Uh, we'll never give up. If I were to die, ah, yes. Is there anything more inspiring the than the hope bullet? <laughs> <laughs> Don't lose hope now. All my fortune telling senses are telling me not to leave this place. And I'm right 30% of the time. <laughs> yeah. Let's live. It's moving forward, right? Yeah. So even if it's hard, even if we're scared, we don't have any choice, do we? You do. That's the whole point of this. Yeah, there, there, you're making a choice. I've been thinking about all this, and I was thinking, at a time like this, what would Sakura do? She'd take two blows to the back of the head and die. <laughs> and as she died, she would go, In the end. <laughs> no matter what, Master has to come along with us. Alright. We well, if that's what it takes, then fine. As long as there's hope, we'll never give up. If I were to die. I'm gonna Losing fucking shoot hope. all of you with hope! <laughs> no, you're wrong! I mean, no, the hope? I, I don't know. <laughs> I hope you're wrong! <laughs> ah, my hope! Ah, I hate being shot with hope. What's the matter? Got me right in the fucking hope. You're not actually trying to encourage me, are you? No. Just trying to get out alive, dude. Ridiculous. It never even crossed my mind that I might give in to despair. 
but don't misunderstand me. I couldn't care in the slightest what happens to you. Aww, he's having one of those little anime moments. Yeah. That's sweet. It's not like I like you or anything. Ugh, whatever, yeah. <laughs> It's not I like I think you're sweet and handsome. <laughs> I swore I would end the life of the master. <laughs> <laughs> your kisses probably taste like strawberries. I don't even care. I didn't really know my father, so I can't pretend to know what he was thinking. But even if we're just connected by blood, there's one thing I am sure of. And what's in there? He would never want us to abandon Makoto and choose to stay here. <gasps> yes! That's uh -huh. right! Oh, that's right. Here's here's a little treat. Uh-huh. Uh, Aaron and I, uh, got tested for the Backstreet Boys reunion tour, and now we are in the same room. What?! To finish... Da... 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 <laughs> I forgot the name of this game. This game? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I'm porky pegging it. Da... 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 da Don Gone Ronpa. It's it, got your name in it. Yeah, man. It's... We're fine. Dragon Rimples. We're... It's finally... We're... We're, we're doing it. And we don't know if there's five minutes left yeah. or six hours. I don't think you wound up at this school because you had- Well, the gym's out of control. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, it's gonna hit her in the face! <laughs> Mr. Spielberg? <laughs> we got- we got Steven Spielberg to do Dunk on Run? <laughs> well, he did do Ready Player One. You came here to confront despair without ever giving up. Oh. That's true. I think we could call you- the ultimate hope. Oh. No. Oh. I think it's dumb. <laughs> no, wait, it, that's really nice. What the, what the hell are you? What? <laughs> the, the ultimate weapon! It's, like, who cares? <laughs> nice. <laughs> Aww. That's way better than what we were assuming for him before, which was, you know, the ultimate average guy. The ultimate whatever. <laughs> yeah. I'm not any kind of a lead anything. Hope is an Italian you develop, but... But still... But I still... HOPE! Oh, are you gonna have to DDR against her? Uh oh. Oh, it's the moment of truth! Wait, what Hell is Hell yeah. This? Oh, it is DDR. Good luck, buddy. Oh! Almost got her! Oh, yeah! yeah. The ultimate hope! Hope keeps on going! Hope keeps on going! Yeah, yeah I'm gonna shoot you with a hope bullet! <laughs> Hope goes at sonic speed! <laughs> I refuse to give up. I refuse to get bored. I refuse to throw it all away! I'm gonna shoot you in the fucking head with <laughs> hope! <laughs> oh my god! Despair. Because all I have going for me is the desire to keep moving forward. Well, that's not a good sentence to say. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that's good about me is yeah. that I I go, I that guess. I, that I hope I might get better. <laughs> Who is found guilty? Junko! Leon! Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> Junko! Like I, like, I just didn't understand how the game works the whole time. <laughs> Even the ultimate despair herself is vulnerable to the onslaught of despair, it would seem. What the heck? But there's no use trying to fight it now! Well, that's just... Okay. <laughs> totally the best! Oh. Oh, good. Huh? Well, that clicked with one of her personalities. <laughs> yeah. I was hope- I was so hopelessly desperate, I was born of the world oh. the moment I was born. I think that choker necklace is on a little tight. <laughs> That's why I've been looking forward to- Does anyone have a hard time breathing in here? <laughs> <laughs> this is what's a lifetime experience. It's my first and last colossal despair here at the moment of death. <laughs> to have the chance to taste of the highest grade despair. Oh. The utter failure of my dreams. That is pure distilled despair. <laughs> mm. Mm, Boy, despair. between her and Toko, there's a lot of drooling going on. And <laughs> I'm not into it. The only despair I know is despair of these nuts. Oh, outstanding. <laughs> really bringing it home, dude. Uh -huh. Ah, stop it! Stop! I hate those faces you're making. To see these awful, those awful looks causes me nothing but pain. It's, it's horrible. I hate it, which causes me despair. So I love it. <laughs> yeah. Which just... makes me hate it. <laughs> it's time to get busy living or get busy dying. <laughs> That's goddamn right, Batman. <laughs> Batman. <laughs> Alfred, please. <laughs> Not what I'm just persuading. <laughs> of, of course, because we... Shut up, did shut call, up! Did you call him Albert? <laughs> Alfred? 
Yeah, and he's not Alfred either. No, he's Fox. He's Lucius, Lucius Fox. Fox. <laughs> this is did, luscious. Did you just call me Albert? Because <laughs> even you're not even I'm not even the character you're trying to refer to. <laughs> Shut up, Alfred. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Hell yeah, she's got swirly glasses. Yeah. Special punishment for last. I'm being hypnotized. Let's give it everything we've got. Oh, God. <laughs> it's a very Doki Doki literature club. <laughs> Yeesh. Hell yeah. Junko has been found guilty. Time for the punishment. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, I hope go. they take out the bear puppet, too. <laughs> How many of them are there? Oh, oh. oh sweet after effects, dude. <laughs> She's all stoked about it. She's like, hell yeah! Bring it on! She probably made it for herself, right? Oh, it's all of them. Oh. Or is it? I don't know. I don't know. The ultimate punishment! <laughs> Doesn't sound too bad for me. Oh, oh wow, yeah, it she is, is gonna them. do it. Wow. <laughs> wow, she's gonna get turned into butter. Hell yeah. Well, you can't say she doesn't stick to what she believes in. Yeah, man. She is a woman of her word. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> How is she still alive after all that? Well, who knows? She's loving it. Wow, she did bring the bear puppet. <laughs> See ya. And. Oh, <laughs> man. That's very satisfying. <laughs> Wow. Well, well. <laughs> how, do, how do we get out now? Yeah. Oh shit, she had the key. <laughs> <laughs> now it's all crushed. Quick, the emergency override <laughs> button. We can save her. <laughs> wow. Boy, she she done got squidooshed. Yeah, she got squishy wishied. And that's how everything came to an end. The final class trial. Junko Anoshima, the ultimate despair. Life at Hope's Peak Academy, it was all over. Wow. Wow, that was awesome. The end. Yeah! Oh my god, Hero's gonna live! Hooray! Oh yeah, your boy. I can't believe it! But even after saying it was all over, 40 hours remained in the playthrough. <laughs> Oh, look at our crew. You know what? I'm even glad that Toko and Byakuya lived. Byakuya's taller than I thought he w w was. Yeah, he's pretty tall. God damn him for being so fucking hot. <laughs> <laughs> but you never know. Maybe it's actually a switch that's gonna make the school self-destruct. Take it from me, the guy that had a burger ascend into space. <laughs> Remember that? <laughs> I mean, no, I don't. Really? <laughs> no. He tells a story about how his burger was abducted by aliens. <laughs> That's right, because it was made of cow. Oh, I love him. There's nothing to worry about. Beautiful if something ever happened to Master, I'd take my scissors and jam them over so far of chew. Uh, hey, where's the corner? Where's the mastermind? You were the mastermind, Toko. Yeah. <laughs> it's all over. What? <laughs> <Let's show! laughs> then that means me and the master could get married? And then he could give me a little jewel of a baby? Yeah, that's what that means. <laughs> Please stop. That would be a greater horror than anything I've encountered so far. <laughs> that would be great if he was like, I just can't take it anymore. Toko, you're so damn hot. <laughs> I can't stop thinking about you. Since it's so big, the wiener, I mean, I'm sure there must be some despair no matter what. But there also has to be lots of hope, right? In other words... That's why I named my testicles Hope and Despair. <laughs> the act of searching for hope, to try and find it, that's by itself the true meaning of hope. <laughs> Whenever I nut, it's always a combination of hope and despair. <laughs> it really is life, huh? I hope this nut can last forever. Oh no! Despair! <laughs> as long as you have that hope, you can keep moving forward no matter what trouble you may fall into. <laughs> Whenever I nut, it's like, it's like the swirly ice cream machine where it's like both of them at the same time. 
<laughs> like I mean, yeah. Chocolate and vanilla. Oh, got it. <laughs> well, my first stop, it's gonna be the closest donut shop. I can figure out the rest of their door opens, it's fucking smoldering ashes. <laughs> <laughs> no! Despair! <laughs> as long as I have people like you around, aww, I can face forward and keep moving. Beautiful. If we can get out there and do something, have some sort of impact. But what can we do? Fuck this shit! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like hope really is spreading. Beep. <laughs> <laughs> the door began to open with my hands, with our hands. The world is perfect and peaceful and untouched. <laughs> yeah. Yay! It's like birds. Oh, but we're in Philadelphia. <laughs> no! <laughs> Man, I hope they show what's actually going on. I hope they don't leave it open ended. Oh, they're I mean, gonna leave would, it open-ended. How would they have a s sequel if they left it open-ended? I guess that's the only way they would have a sequel. Is it credits? Is it- it's gonna be credits. Oh, give me a break. Go! Oh! Oh! I knew it! Son of a bitch! Oh, maybe... uh... No. No, man! Fuck! <laughs> Fuck, we're gonna have to play the second Come one. Come on! Now. I get, yeah, I guess it makes sense, because how would there be a second one if they didn't explain it? God I mean, uh. damn it. One thing I will say for this game, it it really was totally unlike anything I've seen before. And uh you know, we've played a lot of games <laughs> on this show and in our lives. So it, it's uh I mean it really it really was creative and interesting and the characters were fun and lovable yeah. and even the ones that you hated, it was like fun to hate them. <laughs> so, it, it was- it was great. Yeah, I had fun shouting at Byakuya. Oh yeah. Stupid yeah. asshole. Yeah. Whoa, I don't remember that. Jeez, he's Louise. When is that from? I don't know. Uh... What the hell game were we playing? <laughs> yeah, did we miss something? Maybe they- maybe they like edited it in the American version and then... Who knows? Spike what? Chunsoft, you really made- Do they make anything else other than Danganronpa? I don't know, do they need to? Oh, there you go. Yeah, I mean, like, they definitely made their mark. Alright, after credit scene, come on. Maybe? After credit scene. You hey! Yeah, yeah. Ooh, poo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> oh. Interesting. Things are getting very interesting indeed. Wait. <laughs> How's that possible? <laughs> like I said at the beginning, I'm not a teddy bear. Uh. I am Monokuma. Monokuma? And I am your... I am this school's... Ultimate Despair? Headmaster. Oh, Schnibby. What? What? Uh, what? what? Ooh, uh. I just got chills. <laughs> What? You got an item! You got the Easter egg. But, uh, but, yes, I guess I'll save it. I'll I mean, you said, like, different. Junko had to be working with someone. Maybe Monokuma's like this autonomous... ...thing. Yes, we have gotten your many, 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 many requests. And I'm sure we will do another one of these games in due time. Uh... We'll, we'll take a we'll take a break. Yeah, we'll give it a hot minute. Yeah, maybe maybe a year. This is, <laughs> this, like is that. this is the first Game Grumps series since like we were doing ten minute episodes. That's like gone this long. I think so. This was definitely one of the most passionate reactions to any series we've ever done in the nearly eight years that I've been on the show. Anyway. Yeah, it was it was really you know because there's 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 a bit of a dissonance I feel between like what we want to play and like what the fans want us to play and like sometimes when we're like all right we'll play this game and then it just doesn't hit um this was really satisfying because it was something that was very highly requested um and for so long yeah like years people have been requesting this game and uh we played it and it was like we fucking loved it yeah we were way into it from the beginning so as soon as the first person died i was like i'm in i'm in <laughs> Um, all right. Well next time on Game Grumps. Yeah next time on Game Grumps uh, something completely different. We love you uh, Hope you enjoyed this wild wild series wild wild west Goodbye. Bye